Holy shit, that's fucking coffee. coffee. Wait, that, that means she doesn't want coffee. Pack, 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 pack,
Wait, hold on. Oh, there we go. Hold up, is anyone good? You're fell. Tell, 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 tell. I'm gonna Goomba stomp you. All right, Geo. I so can't Goomba stomp both. Stop before I do. This is the oh. next iteration. Hey, yo, Hopefully this time we'll get the good ending, right? Hopefully. Mm -hmm. I mean, don't get too high. Ship. Considering don't how many times we've been getting the normal like ending before we got the bad ending. But no, we will get the good thing. thing. All you have oh, to do okay. is send your credit card to me and the wacky numbers on the back. I'll take you for an adventure. Okay, EA. Let's hope. Hopefully this shit part is... <laughs> right. Sorry, we're gonna make it an unreal shooter. Hit you later, I'm gonna go for Oh, oh, you're spinning. Hey, Shane. Yeah, the team's gonna be the narrator. You're pulling my tactic with a riot avatar. Yes, Wishes. What's your question? Something... something... Something came up, and uh, my mom is what I do is I use the default emote. I can't... I can't do it tonight. I gotta go. No worries, wishes. Take care, and I hope all is well. Thank you. Impossible. Ten. When did you have an offspring? Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. It seems you've met with an uncertain fate. You find yourself at an interdimensional crossroads. A rendezvous of travelers between worlds. My name is Sheen. I am a highly metastasized, infomorphic, mimetic meme complex and one of the tour guides of VR Travelers. We create immersive, story-based tours with original writing, beautiful worlds, voice acting, and a wholesome team effort. Welcome to the Rendezvous, our point of contact in narrative domains. Tonight, we will be telling the story of the pilot. You are welcome to stream and or record this event. I will now drop an invite plus portal to the world of the pilot. While I prepare this, if you are experiencing lag due to the number of users, I recommend that you take this opportunity to turn your performance settings down and or hide avatars you are not friended with. This should considerably improve your lag. My friends, this will be an invite plus instance at this time, make sure you are friends with someone else here, in case you get disconnected and need to be invited back in. You are welcome to add us tour guides, Trajim, Rendizo, or myself to assist with this. Now, enough talk. The ether is thick tonight, and the portal will now open. Maybe. There it is. Oh, oh. God damn it. Uh, here we go, damn it. Here we go again. Damn. Oh. Oh. Okay, who no has worries, a client friends. turned on? We don't need to ask who has a client. No worries. We have a solution. Let me try one more time. Just a moment. Solution. All right, my friends, 
No worries. This is a common occurrence for VRC. Our solution is as follows. Trajim, my fellow tour guide, has already created an instance of the world of the pilot. Do you see Trajim standing near me? Make sure you have him added as, added as a friend or me. Trajim will also post a link to this instance in our Discord if you have joined it. Our Discord ID is my status in VR chat. Check my status to join our Discord and find the link to the world. Alternatively, you can send an invite request to Trajim or myself as soon as we join the world. Does anyone have any questions about this? Uh, I have I, I have one. Actually, <clears throat> it's just a quick one. It, it'll, it'll probably it'll probably be no, but <clears throat> is this world uh quest friendly or is it strictly PC related? My friend, apologies. None of our worlds are quest compatible. Oof. That's a good thing I hopped on PC to Let's do this, huh? Myself. <laughs> Due to the animations yeah. and the level of resolution we use, it is currently impossible, but perhaps there will be a solution in the future. Mm, yeah. 10,000 apologies to you, Kirby. You can request off me, okay? It's quite alright. Okay. I was hoping to do quest for this for this one, but, but it's quite alright. If you use Link or have Air Link, that also works. Virtual desktop is better. Mm. All right, my, my mm -hmm. friends, I'm going to join Trajim in the world. You can send an invite request to me or to Trajim. But for me, you'll have to wait till after I load into the world, so please wait about one minute. I'll be joining him now. If anyone has any trouble joining, send a message in the Discord, and we will help you. No worries at all. All right. And request sent to Trajim, and here it is. And there he goes. My friend, I'm Ghost? handling invite requests. Oh, okay. I can't yeah, my right arm. I was just about to say, if anyone needs it, I would. <laughs> Pleasure to I see you in the digital flesh once again. Yes. I Giddy. found some new settings on my voice changer that let me talk right in your ear. No. You have any no. in your back pocket for emergencies? 
Well, it's not really changing my voice. It's just um, changing the game. Yes. Game. Uh, in specific Basically, directions. ASMR mode. Yes. Um, no, 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 no. I just realized that was me. Preview no, for not tonight. This one. I just have Thanks. to answer this one. Uh, where is it? Oh, it was that. I, I was sort of making a subtle joke reference. I wasn't meaning what you actually. <laughs> Wait, you actually have an avatar where you can pop up copy abilities. I think it's much better on here. Not exactly. I'm still learning how to do that, but the main, the most I got is this. Huh, you can do fire. You're fine. Not on the floor. Don't I wonder if that's actual, actual fire. fire. It does. I would be able to do two, but then I burned down my computer. I can turn these yeah, segments yeah, none of us want to the that. Yeah. yeah. The more you turn that thing up, the farther I'm going to walk away. I'm going to talk to Sheen and okay. see how he reacts. Uh, <laughs> there we go. Right here. Hey, yeah. Oh, There's a special coffee. something. I'm not sure. There's a special something. Oh, yeah, there's there's a smart 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 I don't want to count. I found some new settings on my voice changer that allow me to talk to I am like a to your ear. That sounds... Yeah, the moment the thing went by, we were actually already getting into the demo for this issue. Yeah, I, I, I will <laughs> use it yeah, twice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kind of like, yeah, yeah, yeah. like you kind of like a little plush. You can't just cry there and like, I should probably save that. I probably, I don't have that word. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I've been there. I, don't, I just don't have it saved. Hmm? I'll save it, please. Oh, at least then. I'm just like, friends with Mr. Eddie. Also, I'm just like, you too? Well, it's something that should help us. <laughs> oh, okay. Finally comfortable. I need to get one of those feet hammocks for under my desk. I'll give you mine when I find it. Okay. I don't use it, so. Yeah, I like having my feet propped, and so like. Onward. So like um. Oh, hello again, Captain Panda. What the fuck? So the funniest thing about Umba, where's Timon? We have so much in common. We both hate Starbucks. We both hate all these things. Caffeine. Okay, I'm done. I need to turn this shit to the so I sound normal again. Yeah, we're oh, idiots. Wait, there we go. That's, that's about it. Well, that's most of us here in VR chat. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. If you're in VR chat, you kind of have like a... On my voice changer. Okay, good, good. Now that's the usual way to ask questions. Thank you. I'll be tomorrow. 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 I'll
Thank you, travelers, for your attention. Welcome to the world of the pilot. Welcome to 2022 VR Travelers. It is wonderful to see you all again. Tonight we have a special event planned. Our greatest performance ever of the pilot. I assure you. We've said this before, but yet again we have made changes to reduce the total length of this tour while preserving the quality. Fear not for your hours of sleep you worry for. My friends, as with any tour in the real world, we kindly ask that you remain silent during narration. However, it is absolutely imperative you do talk as we walk, as planning and working together with your friends is the only way to new endings. At this time, make down. sure your world music is turned up. You should clearly be able to hear the wind. Also, I would like to ask the group, how is my audio settings? Am I too close? Too far away? How does it sound? Sounds just right to me. You're good. Very good. Sounds good. Sounds Very good. Ever so slightly. No sound very quiet on my end. You and I want to check your settings. How about now? That's okay. Yes. I just had an intimidating voice there for a moment. On my end. So good. I'm joking. Nice to have you back, me. All right. Thank you for the feedback, friends. It is time we connect to this narrative domain. The pilot has been waiting for us. In a dream of legend. and a dream within a dream, perhaps. How far down will we go? Perhaps we're already there. Does the pilot keep track of how many times she meets us? Is she even aware? One would think no. But something else is going on for sure. Nevertheless, my friends, enough talk. Everyone, please, click the save point behind me. You like to save your game? Oh, yes, Dio, I really would like to. We got some new recruits. Oh. Oh, spicy. That'd, be, that'd be really nice, wouldn't it, to be able to save your game? Alright, Gio, I wonder that's if you can actually insane. pull up you the T pose this time game. without using an emo. Your life doesn't work that way, so I can't. I'm making, um, pro tag. And now, without further ado, the story begins. Hey. Between the forest and the countryside, there sits a lone house, and in this lone house is a young girl. Every evening, she looks out her bedroom window, and her imagination soars. She wonders about the faraway, exotic places her father always tells her about. She closes her eyes, and she can see them. Beautiful cities filled with waterfalls and white birds, majestic Mountains capped by clouds so soft, one could fall asleep on them. She wonders and she wonders, until the sun sets and the crickets fill the air. In her mind, the scene shifts to the front door. She pictures her father finally coming home. She hopes for it with all her heart. It's going to be tonight. She knows it is. Her heart flutters as she opens her eyes expectantly. The sky is purple, and the path outside is empty. 
This is... No, she was wrong. He hasn't come home. She shoves the curtains across and turns from the window. Oh dear. My friends, let's go inside and see if she's all right. This way. Okay. Oh, the table is shorter. Eh. Or is it just... Would you look at this the El Pot returns. Bling. 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 There we go. <laughs> El Pot. <laughs> yeah, but the J base is better. The El Pot. I regret not having a chair. The young girl trudges through the dark house. The kitchen is empty. Her mother has forgotten to cook again. The girl grabs an apple from the table, pulls up a chair, and eats alone. She closes her eyes again, wanting to go to another place. The image slowly forms in her mind. Wisp of mist brushing by. The gentle rush of cool air in her ears. The deep thrum as she passes through clouds. The land far below her. Everything cast in a radiant golden light. Then the sky knocks. No, not the sky. She opens her eyes. Could it be? The chair clatters to the ground as she runs toward the front door. She can't contain her excitement. There he is, finally home. She lets out a cry of joy and a bit of sadness and her father picks her up holding her tightly is mama still sleeping by the radar papa's voice is comforting like the cloud she flew through only when you're gone so long her mother's voice drifts in warming the room she joins them in a tight embrace. <laughs> I'll always come back, he says. He takes out a sealed bottle of capsules from his jacket and hands it to the mother. He apologizes for only being able to get enough for ten months. He seems really sad about it. Don't worry, the mother says. I'll manage. I always have. And soon, the house is filled with the warm glow from the fire. The sounds of laughter. The smell of a rose. And the little girl could not possibly be more happy. After dinner, the girl asks her father for another story about the pilot. He looks at her as the smile slowly spreads across his face. My friends, let's all go together and listen to Father's story. This way. Boing, boing. Up the stairs. Wait, I thought only three hey. could be Up here, Kathy. Why are there so many pairs of shoes? <laughs> this is a mighty small <laughs> room. Like your voice so does not matter. Ow. The young girl jumps into bed, mm -hmm. and the father and mother sit either side of her. The father tells another story about his daughter's favorite hero, the pilot. Each time the father would revisit this story, the pilot would be on a new adventure. 
but each time, a few themes remain the same. The pilot flies to new worlds with their legendary ship. And wherever they go, they meet new friends who need their help. The odds would be stacked against them. But thanks to their trusty, legendary ship, the pilot always saves the day. The girl remains awake till the very end. And then the father asks, as he does at the end of every story. <laughs> so, why do you think the pilot helps people? The young girl squeezes her bunny doll and cheers. Because it's the good thing to do. The mother and father look at one another, smile, and then laugh. The daughter doesn't know what happened, but she laughs with them anyway. As her parents leave the room, the girl asks if, when she grows up, she can fly to other worlds to help people, just like the pilot. Of course, the father says. You'll be the greatest pilot, and... Someday, you will save the day, too. I just know it. The mother looks out the window. They tuck her in. The father turns off the light, and they leave the door ajar for their daughter. My friends... Let's go back downstairs and let her sleep. This way. You'd run so sweet. Pilot. In my chair. Oh, cheers, everyone. Hello. Salupat. Salupat. What is this world? What's going on? Ricky, are on a tour. The story is being told. Silence. Oh, yeah, the plunger goes in your. Ah, the newcomers. Welcome, friends. The story continues. The mother and father sit together in the living room. She asks him if he did what he set out to do, and if he was tracked. He says the same thing he always says. Of course not. He was careful. He starts talking about being able to get away with unregistered flights and is about to go into the tendency for military officers to turn a blind eye to a certain amount of excess cargo when she stops him with a finger on the lips. She reminds him that she knows all of this already. He laughs and gets one more detail in. She will always know when anything is approaching thanks to the radar he stole. If a military vessel gets near, it will notify her. She nods. She knows this already. And so they both decide that it's a topic for another time. Her husband is home again, and she missed him dearly. And so, they both go to bed. <laughs> the mother is woken suddenly. It's the father. He's talking about something on the radar, headed for the refugee camp. She rubs her eyes, confused. I have to go, says the father. I have to get them out. She doesn't understand. She pleads for him not to leave again. Still not sure what exactly is happening. She suggests that it's just a scout or an error. No, the father says, and his voice frightens her. Look, look, look at the radar. 
the mother looks, and her heart drops. The signal is enormous. The largest airship she's ever seen, and it's headed directly for the rebel camp off the radar's edge. That's, she begins, but her voice falters. Yes, says the father. The Dark Monument airship. Uh, last time it was deployed, it laid waste to everything from Eternic to the Equavi Islands. The death toll was in the millions. Fire fell from the sky for weeks after, and to this day, nothing grows there. Hidden forest camps, underground bases, networks under towns, it doesn't matter. Nobody is safe from this thing. Sending it there could only mean... He doesn't finish. He doesn't need to. I'll join you, the mother says. I was an engineer in the military. I can help. You were, until they discharged you for your condition. He takes hold of her shoulders and looks her in the eyes. The moonlight from outside dims, and the room goes dark. I need you to stay here. Protect our daughter. <laughs> the gray soldiers will easily detect her potential. They'll take her away from us. We can't let our daughter become another weapon for them. The mother feels as though she is in a nightmare. Can't you contact the, the Ethos Coalition for help? The Coalition's resistant ships won't make it here in time. I, I can outrun that abomination. I smuggled them in to the camp in the first place, so it's up to me to get them out of there. I am their only hope. His hands slide down her arms, and he takes hold of her fingers. She's trembling. Listen, I was the same as them. A refugee on the run, remember? And then you... You rescued me. I have to return the favor. It's... It's the good thing to do. Reluctantly, she nods. He kisses her and rushes out into the night with his things. The house is cold and dark once more. And the mother and daughter are left alone. One year passes. The father has not returned, and the daughter has just turned six. The mother lost contact with the Ethos Coalition months ago. Every night she waits by the radar, staring at the night sky. Tonight, her daughter is with her, and together they watch wondering if the moon is going to reappear. The silence is broken by the daughter. Mama, are you going to listen to the radio all night again? The mother doesn't answer. Daddy said, it's bad for your heart to stay up. The mother looks down at her daughter. Smiles, turns off the radar, holds her for a while, and puts her to bed. She promises that she will sleep on time and closes the door. The mother goes back to the radar and turns it on. She listens with her head in her arms. She listens until sleep takes her. A loud voice screeches. Attention! Attention! This area is under martial law by order of the Grey. 
surrender all ether users immediately or face execution. She... she wakes, changes through channels, but it's everywhere. It's in her head. She presses her hands against her ears, but the voice fills her mind. Then she looks at the radar, and she sees it. It's already over the forest? The cursed ship is here. But why? No, she doesn't have time to think. They have to escape. The mother rushes upstairs, wakes her daughter, and dresses her. The daughter only has time to grab her bunny doll before a banging sound echoes from the ground floor. The sounds of splintering wood terrify them both, and they run toward the outside balcony. Quickly, my friends, this way. I have the cats and run. Come on. Yeah, seriously. Oh. What? Oh, fun. We did it at the uh, Tell what have you done? I didn't bring glasses this time. That, mm -hmm. I got you. I, I didn't bring any. I don't have any. This is no time to fall. <laughs> you fucking <laughs> broke away. <laughs> or everything. I don't know. I can't feel any pain right now. I don't know how to make fire. Oh, there's the pain. Your servers ah. don't seem to be damaged. <laughs> they seem to be functional. <laughs> They're fine. There's, there's your no are functional. I'm not the, I didn't push your mom. Probably in dirt. She looks like a frozen one. My friends. The story continues. Some chips misplaced, but you can live. Yeah, I, I want to fucking grab your cheek and fucking scratch it like... BRB, you gotta use the restroom. Who are they? Cries the little girl. Mama, I'm scared. The mother holds her daughter tight and jumps from the balcony. She hits the ground hard. Landing on her side, a sharp pain shoots through a broken rib. But her daughter is safe, and that's all that matters. She stands and looks around. The entire forest is in flames. They must have detected her. No. There, a path through the walls of fire. It's the only way. My friends, over here. Lucia, what the hell are you? I mean, Dearman. Fuck, why am I reverting again? Yeah, Oh, man. Alright, Laurier. Let's go. Boing. Laurier was never mine. I don't know what's happening. You're reverting like him. Don't wanna. Oh, burn. god damn it. Shut the Thrill. fuck up. It's the bat ship. You smell sugar, did you? Oh, my god. She struggles. She struggles to run. Her daughter is heavy. She glances over her shoulder. Dark figures are circling the house, peering through the clouds of smoke. Then the mother looks up, and she sees it. A horrifying shape eclipses the moon. Its silhouette drops a blanket of slow-moving shadow, smothering the land below in darkness. The airship creeps slowly, unstoppably, toward them. She places her daughter on her feet and kneels to look her in the eyes. Mama is going to run, and you must run too. She barely manages to get her words out. You must not let go of my hand. Do you understand? Do not let go. Is that a monster? The little girl stammers, with eyes welling up. No, don't look at it, the mother cries. Take my hand and don't let go. One of the soldiers yells in the distance. The mother grips her hand tight and they run. The mother's heart is racing. The fire is unbearably hot and the smoke scrapes in her throat. My friends, the mother and daughter have been spotted and are now pursued by the Dark Monument. Together, they must find a way through the burning forest, and so must all of you. This is your first quest. Click the pressure safe point, and as fast as you can, run for their lives. Don't forget to jump over the flames.
Speed run time. First time I'm doing it tiny. Oh my god. This is amazing. Two frames a second, let's go! Ooh, I made it with that. No, it's the same. Oh, you can jump yeah, over the fire. You can jump I'm over the fire. I'm getting like 10 frames a second. Yeah. 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 That's what I've been yeah. saying for the past three tours. Oh. Same. I, got fucking, I, got I usually like scorch my kid is dead. Immediately. <laughs> well, Scarlet well, goes to miss it. She discovered it first. Parkour. <laughs> okay. So, Yarmud, what do you think the chances of us getting I got a new record? Who you knows? Well, Not bad for the first know. run. <laughs> okay! Well, I see why people like to pilot. I'll break us off. I'll break us off. I got a new record. Someone's having me. Whoever just said you like the pilot, be it known that the pilot likes you. I did not expect that to be bad. Is everyone in my Hello, can the pilot hear my voice? Thanks for my sick parkour. I didn't Not currently. At all. Oh, hey, Gio, were you, were you timing uh, me? Uh, I think I got a new record on time. Uh, I got the turns out the planes have nothing against the power of jumping. Oh, tell, oh, tell, oh, tell the oh, pilot oh, I say oh, hi. Oh, I have some Saint Scorch Marts. I will, Gio. Holy crap! Oh, my. I see really equalization. Next time, Adam is now a session for the trial of the Armoud, who is charged with the crime of being wholesome. But two to being spotted, Josh I have been sent back. He's going to jail. Ah, so that's how you fail. I've witnessed it. I've witnessed it. Yeah. <laughs> You'll figure why, out the time. I honestly. Why? The tactical <laughs> situation was all the zoom. Specifically, the mouse. <laughs> yeah. I didn't mean, yeah, yeah, talk more. I think I'm like, due to my faulty yeah, processors, I couldn't react as fast as I usually do. I may or may not have seen it ahead to get some more cinematic photos. That is the most unfortunate. Hey, we made it. I am a failed <laughs> machine. Uh, you just need some upgrades. I saw you ahead of me and then you come back. Of course, that is the thing. Due to the fact that I am a failed machine. I only did that once. That was only the first time in the beginning. Everything else is fine. I'll crack something. Write it. I don't know. 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 I would be able to go past that place oh, pretty easily if my flight capabilities are still operational. Oh, okay. Sadly, I just have to sadly, space. it is not operational. <laughs> <laughs> there seems to be a lot of space. Space. Who cares about personal space? That was annoying, Tech! Oh my god! <laughs> so many times, just. He's here. Every time I was like, I kept walking into a cone and I'm like, back to spawn, back to spawn. <laughs> Are you talking about Stop saying me back to spawn! Who is you? I, I don't know. It's me. I'm it looks interesting. I know it's in Cyborg, but I can't remember what it is. He is right. There is one. There is a quick travel menu. I did not know this. You put your hand above your head and you click your trimmer. Uh, uh, yes, you heard that. You press menu. You press menu. You'll see a big window pop up. Three, double seven. Double seven, double seven, double seven and they'll tell me about that. Yeah. Well, I just went through it like 18 times in a row. Very. Same when I first did that one. You have to do it when your hand is raised above your head. Your right hand raised above your head in order to make it work. Yeah, I'm done here. Otherwise, the oh, menu just won't show for you. Right, uh, that way you don't accidentally spawn at all the dang time. Hey, what? This is the first time me seeing oh, Captain Panda in a panda costume. Hey, we did it. Come on, I can increase my DPI and make it worse. Hey, we did it. 
Nobody can. Equalized. That was annoying. Like a Yu -Gi -Oh card. Careful, eh. I had to switch into my frog so we didn't feel the fire. <laughs> You're lagging. Oh. It's not the story good. continues. <laughs> well done. I hope you're enjoying it so far. Mm -hmm. For the pilot's sake. My friends, we've made it somehow. Please, walk this way. Walk this way. Talk this way. Walk 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 this Guys, I found a log. Just let me burn it. Yeah, oh yeah, this is not very smooth traveling with with the comments. Like, okay, to be fair, this is 2.0 oh, avatar. Oh, so, my friends, gather around. Shabaler, the story continues. I better get ready for that. By the way, I'm glad that all of you walked that way. It was. Wonderful. Now then. Yes. Apologies. I must change the mood because the next part of the story is not nice. Roger that. Oh, Unfortunate. The mother and daughter stagger into a secluded clearing. Nearby is a tent. An old campfire and a pond. Raindrops pat against the canvas, the leaves of the trees, and the water's surface. The ground squelches beneath every footstep. The rain is cold, but the chill soothes the mother's burns. They won't have to worry about the fire spreading this far. Inside the tent, Mother speaks words of comfort to her wailing child, cradling her in her arms. The traumatized girl grips her bunny and buries her face into the mother. The rain masks her tears, and she soon sleeps. The mother, however, does not and keeps watch all through the stormy night. When the last of the daughter's sniffles subside, <coughs> she begins to dream of a faraway place, a dark place. She descends into a nightmare. My friends, please use the nightmare save point. Um, why? Uh, because we're about to go through. Maritime. Gonna be piled up. <clears throat> Don't go through the wall. Gregory, do you see that vent on the ground? Have you ever heard of Among Us? Stay oh. here, friends. Among Us. Stay Shut here. Up. Shut the up. Gregory. Gregory, do you, you see that small you see that Gregory, you play this? Gregory, have you ever heard of Among Us Gregory? Terrible job, little shit! Uh, 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 I'm done. My friends, listen carefully. That's the personal one. Yeah, I understand. Here we go. Tonight's. NPCs, please come forward, stand next to me, and change into your searchlight avatar in front of the group. My friends, do you see them? This should be Diarmid and Tricky Cat. NPCs, 
please turn on your searchlights and show your searchlights to the group. I can barely see the searchlight, but I, I can see it. Searchlight is very, very dim. It is kind of dim, yeah. Or a light in this room. Really searchlights over there. Dim. You want the old avatar? Sure I have the old avatar. Uh -huh. Now then, no, right. my friends, listen carefully. Is there anyone in the group that cannot see these NPCs, Diarmid and Tricky Cat, standing next to me? Good. Now, NPCs, please tell the travelers of your nature. I am for the dreams of every soul, but I must not give a fighting chance to those who traverse this land as part of the contract. When I am near, you will hear this sound. I am near. You will hear. Ow. When I am near. Thank you, NPCs. NPCs. Remain here. My friends, listen carefully. A figure is suddenly aware of their surroundings. The walls are cold and slick. The floor is a solid void, and the air shimmers with a shadowy haze. The unknown figure looks about, barely able to see anything. What am I doing here? I was searching for something. Perhaps they think. There are voices audible in the distance, echoing and distorted, drawing closer. The figure realizes they can't stay here. They must find a way out. And so must all of you. As this is your next quest, listen carefully, travelers. Search for a way through the darkness, and avoid these monsters at all cost. Getting caught in a monster's cone of light will, tri will fracture the girl's hope, and you will hear thunder crash. If you are caught, keep moving. In PCs, take your place at this time. Mm. When, we go, when we go through, look we can all get out of this arrows. maze together. I believe in you. My there friends, are red arrows above head. Follow them through the dark. But there's also hidden walls. She dreams for you, and your quest begins now. Don't get caught, and good luck. I believe in you. Robotica can't see. Aye, aye, aye. <laughs> it would have been funny if this avatar actually had, like, XE had. Oh my gosh, I hear one. Right, 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 right. Don't go that way, don't go that way. What's that? Oh, shit. Not this way. Oh, oh. Back up. Wait, is it? They are near. Run! I didn't know.
low self. I was scared. Don't be so <laughs> Get on the bed, Gregory. Oh, that's venting. better. You're venting. You're stuck. Easy. <laughs> oh, and that's four. God damn it. So, so Hell yeah. Like, without... Made it Sounds like the just... siren head and one that's in the back. I feel like so these are like two different ends of the spectrum. The dream eaters follow them. So you said that. I made it like I was one of the first I mean, two. Yeah. I get what? Like, we are going to talk way too many times. So I, had I, had to I sat there for a while yeah, thinking, am I supposed to click this? Song? I don't think doing this as the size of a one foot tall creature is a good idea. Help me. Oh, that was close. That's the problem. It's like, I don't know. I have to find out like seven times. I almost got stuck as a. I'm like, you hidden walls and stuff. I got lucky and found a hidden I didn't find any. I was just, I was just following the lines because apparently you just follow the lines and you can make it to the end. We even like got the news. Yeah, but I was following them. But, uh, the How many found out here? You heard seven. I found a hidden. My favorite program. Yeah, and that's when I found like a get because I was like, yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, I like, not again. And then I just nope. almost. Oh, I'm just kidding. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I just lost it. Until I was all alone yeah. with two other people. Oh, oh. okay. I, I, I watched a dire walk right in front of me. That, the, the spot searchlights work so much better in that, in that maze. <laughs> Holy crap, I was and actually I, terrified. I, <laughs> I literally was walking in the void and I heard nothing and I saw him in front of me. I was like, nope, 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 nope. If it doesn't make an audible clap. I think it was kind of crushing me. Come here, come here. Something else got caught. Oh god damn it. Congratulations, you all got your daily nutritional dose yes, of protein. Indeed. I'm inspired. Wait. Anyway, let's get let's I got first dibs. Delicious. Oh, 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 let's get our daily dose of hair. Under the under the I want the hair. I do those robots eat? Oh, 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 don't ask. It's a very, very poorly known, um... Sorry, it's too eager. Very old. Does this a biological uh, generator. Uh, NPC. The vegans. What? Oh god, one of the demons oh, games. Puffy, you're still the best. <laughs> Pretty sure the consumption of robots <laughs> could <laughs> still be considered <laughs> vegan. Pretty sure, scary? thank you. So they're friend of yours, eh, not really. There was a third nightmare in there? Hello. I think that's from FNAF 4. Spawn in the air. I install country. My friends. Your attention, please, dear travelers. My friends, yes, you are right. My bestest of best friends. The story continues. Thank you. The girl wakes herself up, screaming in the dark of night. Her eyes filled with tears as she frantically calls for her mother. Quickly, she comes to comfort her terrified child. The daughter begins describing a dark place with monsters, but she struggles to speak through her trembling. The mother rocks her in her arms, telling her it was just a nightmare not to worry. The daughter tries to go on about how the person in her nightmare was searching for something, but her voice is shaking too much. The mother interrupts, telling her it was not real. She's safe now. Together, they sit rocking for a while as the rain dies down, revealing a morning sun shining like a golden orb between the parting storm clouds.
the mother thinks to herself that the town of Shade has always been a place Rebel Supplies move through. Surely, clues to the Ethos Coalition are there. The mother checks the sky. The sky. Clear. For now. My friends. This way. Let's go field those up missions. Man, I sure hope we don't encounter any maybe more of those little things. Like... Mm -hmm. We're off to see the wonderful Wizard of Oz. This ah, is the Wizard this of Oz. glorious town. Isn't it beautiful? I love having it. Goldfish. This ain't the Wizard of Oz! What is this? Yes. It's just a hotel. Ah, oh, but it's Hotel Roland. My friends, gather around where you can hear. Hotel Roland around with the speed of sound. Alright, yo, prop on time. I'm gonna find the best item in the game, right? The town of Shade is a small, busy, unfriendly place. The people here don't smile or greet each other as they pass. The mother and daughter feel unwelcome. The mother doesn't know who to trust or who is loyal to the Grey City. First, she needs to find a safe place for them to get some proper rest. The mother books a room, which the innkeeper says will be ready a little later. She checks the sky, then tells her daughter they should gather supplies while they wait, as they likely have a long way to go. My friends, this is your next quest. Listen carefully. All of you must explore the town of shade scattered around our various supplies and clues the mother and daughter need if you find an interesting looking item please click it it will appear in your tab key inventory once you do you all must return here before time has expired, I repeat, you all must return here before time has expired. There will be a bell that sounds as long as you have world music turned on. That bell will signal your five minutes is up. Huh. So we return when the bell hits or before the bell hits? Count five minutes and use your conscience <laughs> to decide. But when you hear the bell, make haste to come back to this door. My I friends, if the, town of shade has some... oh. the sky is clear for now. And so your quest begins. Good luck. I wonder if the town okay, let's go. Shade. One more question. How does one open the inventory in uh, Index VR? With no tab key. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Where was it over here? I know there was one. I can remember. And press the menu for another button. Okay, cool. Uh, where are we going next? Uh, 
fighting. Oh, I thought I could that. Am I getting it? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Thank you, Papa. Yeah. You scared me. Huh? I will. Item. How do I get out of this building? Uh, on over break. Just click the same, the door, the back area. Mm. Ah, good luck, Charm. Hmm. Oh, some pretty dang Ooh, baby! Woo! <laughs> Amlo. Oh, no longer Amlo. Hey, what the fuck? Lord. I found the Woo Baby. Woo Baby Volume 1. Tree Mag. I think you were somewhere, right? <clears throat> Holy oh. shit, trades and party are going on. Okay, we gotta go to the top of the tower. Are they getting a shade? Oh, baby, that's what I'm waiting for. That's what it's all about. Oh! Zeta Soul over here. Oh. Hey Tyler, you're never gonna believe this. What? I didn't feel like you slept, didn't you? Oh, oh, no. Time to go back anyway. Grab that. I got two dots on your dick. Oh, I nice something to do. Well done. Hopefully, you all found what they need. The innkeeper tells the mother their room is ready. <coughs> this way. I feel like I can. Uh, I called dibs on the bathtub. 
Oh, shit. Yeah. Yeah. Are we we still 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 again? The nude. Hey, you made it. I paid top dollar for this. Yes. I respect what? top dollar Fuck services. So I literally just joined. I don't want to join you. Oh, yeah. Party in the back. And apparently Why turned not? off everything. Hey, Sheen, do you know bathroom. how much we paid for this room? Party bad. Yes, it is. It's like you to be trapped into VR. You got that infamous bathroom scene again. Basically, we had... Basically, the lights and everything flickered, like my monitors, the lights in my room. We paid about. There's a party going on in that bathtub. Wait, seven what? That's nice. Just seven. Don't don't ask questions. It's just seven. Do you have toasters? What? Oh no! Sexy saxophone. Pro tag no. Oh, Say, that would, be, that would make a good manga series. Put your clothes back on. Above your head. Above My friends. What are you doing? Oh, oh, a reminder. Shh. We're in a narrative domain. Be careful not to create other narratives with your jazz music, as that could lead to unforeseen consequences. <laughs> Wait, what do you mean? <laughs> might be be what do you mean other narratives? Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, Oh no! Be better than nothing, dude. Playing careless whisper. What do oh, I mean? It took me a second. Have you seen what the fan base did to Undertale? <laughs> Be careful. Exactly. <laughs> oh no! Same about the illusion. It's not until the end. Oh, somebody write that down. Somebody write that quote down. That sounds delicious. I want a steak. No. I've been lucky so far. I want steak. That sounds delicious. Exactly. I don't want to be the next monster kid. I also enjoy steak. Cue the 80s intro. My friends, the story continues. <laughs> 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 no, Apologies, friend, but the mood of the story is in quite a difference of contrast. Open your ears and your hearts if you dare. The two make their way up to the prepared bedroom and begin settling in. It's quiet inside the inn. Clouds have gathered outside, casting the small space in a dull gray light. Finally, they can rest. The daughter is helping her mother sort the items they gathered today. She wants to help by carrying a few of them in her own little bag. But she isn't sure which items to choose. My friends, listen carefully. Press the tab key to view, view your inventory. If you're in VR, hold your right hand above eye level and press the menu or jump button. Look at your inventory, my friends. We, as our next quest, must decide what three items, which three items, the daughter will carry for her mother. And now, I will ask you. Let's see. You, Ether Memento. Oh. Of the items you found, which one do you decide the daughter will carry? for her mother. You may ask the group if you wish, and you have 30 seconds to he decide. And one, one more thing. what you thing. would like to bring, because... Apologies, I have forgotten this detail. Last time, we chose the Dragon Master's Ocarina, the Pilot Shield, and the Frozen Flame. These three items are unchoosable this round. So, either Memento, which item do you choose? TIA Director's Code, TIA Director's Code, TIA Director's Code, TIA Director's okay, Code, TIA Director's Code. TIA Director's Code, TIA Director's Code, TIA Director's Code. I, okay. Apologies, friends, but the floor belongs to Ether Memento. What is your choice, friend? Um, TIA Director's Code, please. Yes! Man, <laughs> you could have been had it. Man. That was straight up here. Well, I happen to know Dio is a, a, a veteran here. 
path now. Like, I have Geo. Geo next. Your wife. The Dare program exists. Uh, My oh. friends, oh. now for oh. the <laughs> second. <laughs> wow. What did he say? <laughs> I'm the reason for this reason this program exists. I'm the reason this program exists. This, this, this is going this right into tour quotes. I see. The Dare program exists. <laughs> Alright, so many quotes. Probably one of the best tours for 10,000 apologies. <laughs> okay. My friends, the second item must be chosen. And for the second item, I will try to call on somebody that I do not recognize. Let's see. Oh, I like your name. DJoy Remix. May I ask you? Oh, shit. What? Will the daughter carry for her mother? Huh. If you are unsure, you are welcome to ask the group. The floor is yours. Rat's comfy scarf. Uh, <laughs> the one I was thinking was yeah, the pilot's promise, mode. personally. But... Oh no, we want to do the drip. Uh... We want to do the drip set though. Are we just going going all the items that belong to travelers? I am to make kid. I asked the child puts on all the clothing items, and it's like that one. I am kicking out. Deep toy remix. You have twenty seconds remaining. Please take the comfy scarf. Go with the pilot saying seven isn't top dollar. Go for the scarf. Come on, go for the scarf. Go for the scarf. I feel like it's a better. Personally, Seven megabytes. They're going with the pilot's yeah. promise. Yeah, probably. Also, I don't think I. Uh, do I have? No, I don't have guard in mind. But yeah. I'm Is that your final answer? D Joy Remix. Yes. Item number two: the pilot's yes. promise. Now for the third item. Let's come again. Mm, spoke too soon. Ninpin or ninpin. Apologies if I'm pronouncing it incorrectly. Oh. May I ask you, what is the third item the daughter will bring? Uh, violet I, think... I, I mean, Rat's comfy scarf. I think. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna stop here pressuring. It's free real estate. I think they're mute. I heard them say something. I mean, there's a difference oh, between peer pressuring and oh, suggesting dreaming. something. <laughs> you can suggest something and yeah. explain reasoning, or you no. can just. No! 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 The suggestion no. requires reasoning. Peer pressure, peer pressure no. is just telling you to do it. Yes, the dream egg. Stop peer pressuring yeah. them! God damn it! The I mean, it's too late. It, that's why I'm saying no. A wonderful choice. It's too late. <laughs> I hope we can get the good we ending have... with these items. Wait, Geo, do items count for the good ending? My friends. We'll, well done. Be it's been a while. I see. The daughter chooses the dream egg, the pilot's promise, and what was the other one? The TIA the director's, director's code. code. TIA director's code. Yes. <laughs> Very well. The story continues. <laughs> the mother sits on the bed, leaning against the window frame. She's tired of running, tired of hiding, but she cannot stop. Yet, she looks through the window at the town as the evening sun sinks behind gray clouds. It all paints the buildings with a soft pink light. The daughter jumps up on the bed, cuddles up to her mother, and holds tightly onto her bunny doll. It's very cute, the mother thinks. Are we going to stay here? She asks. I... I want to go home. The mother 
brushes her daughter's hair to the side. Not for long. We're going somewhere else. Tomorrow, somewhere safe. Is that where Daddy went? The daughter looks up at her mother, hopeful. I think so. You need to sleep, so you can walk with me tomorrow. You need to sleep too. The little girl nudges her and places a hand over her mother's heart. She can feel it beating steadily. The feeling comforts her. Daddy said, I need to protect Mama. The mother breaks into a heartwarming smile. You already are, my angel. Daddy says you're a good luck charm, as though you have friends watching over you all the time. Friends watching over me and Bunny? She looks at the ceiling. She looks around the room. But there's nobody there. The mother laughs. Mm-hmm. The daughter squeezes her bunny doll and goes silent. She thinks deeply for a six-year-old. Mama, will my friends watch over your heart, too? She puts an arm around her daughter and pulls her in. And her answer comes only as a whisper between them. A fragile breath. I hope so. I hope so. The daughter nods and snuggles up close. She falls asleep within minutes. The mother wipes tears from her own eyes and looks back out the window. Night has come. My friends, mother will keep watch while we all sleep. For what is good never lasts. Please, use the nightmare save point to follow the daughter into her dreams once more. All right. Dreamy time. Oh okay. boy. Here we go again. Oh, oh, let's go. Your progression. Yeah. Here. Give me my 200 bucks from Joe. Do not, oh. Do not debt. collect 200 dollars. Oh, this is different. Don't fall. The Traveler's yep. Monopoly. Right. Can you imagine? <laughs> Wait, guys, we should, we should... So you could say you're riding me. No, no, just, no, just, no, the Monopoly VR Traveler's Edition. I actually tried to hit the grab yeah. button to Is this make it. Is this one of those, like, make it now. that Hollywood does? Tonight's NPCs. Please come and stand next to me. Then change Seriously, into your Dream Eater avatars. Show... Dream you. Eater avatars. Oh lord. Yeah, that is a, oh, that's a big one. Oh! Oh, oh aren't yeah. you terrified? Okay. Adorable. Oh. Uh, hey. I'm perfectly crabs. Attack and sweep points for massive damage. Oh, oh, aren't you slightly terrified? They enemy spoilers. You look like my power. Yeah, I don't think it's not this. Yeah, it's kind of the hermit crab. I love the way I walk. Zergatry. <laughs> 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 I'm definitely going to go. Yep. Yo, Zergatry. <laughs> Anyone got a ground type? <laughs> Ayo, what the dog doing? My friends, listen carefully. What the dog doing? <laughs> Once more, the unknown figure becomes aware. The air is colder, but their vision feels somehow sharper. Perhaps this place is a little brighter than the last. The last place. Yes, they are here for a reason. The figure thinks in silence. What am I searching for? Why can't I remember who I am? Glancing back over their shoulder, 
they see only swirling shadow, and it evokes a sense of unholy dread. Something is following. My friends, this is your next quest. Listen carefully. This time, there are no monsters to avoid, but instead, a pair of dream eaters block your exit. Find the path that gives you hope. When you reach the end, gather around the dream eaters and together as a group, listen to their spoken trial and give the correct answer. Your quest begins now. Make haste. Would you say our quest gives us determination? You. Except you. Goddamn. He brought up Undertale, all right? I'll take this back. I must find them. I must bring them. She waits at the bottom of the ocean. You're way behind a tide. Yeah. Sometimes bad yeah. things happen. Sometimes bad things happen. Like the yeah. Zero tree. I made it here first. Oh, oh for a moment, that's. The naked guy. No, bro. Be careful, Olivier. Trajim. I made it here first. Oh, somebody died. Crazy or what? I made it here first. Well, we Giant that? enemy we spider. Excellent, this is a family yeah, friendly yeah, 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 yeah. Put some hamster yeah. shirts on to crabs. Good means. No, it's spider crab. There's a giant enemy spider crab. Shiny. Oh, giant enemy spider crab. crab. <laughs> <laughs> I love how everyone's ignoring the like spike ball. Thing. Hey, tiny. <laughs> I mean, like, it's a giant. I have crabs. You know, I take all my damage. You know, I take all my damage. Ayo, it's Mr. Krabs in his ultra form. No, I mean, like, Super Saiyan Mr. Krabs. Money. Samatilla. I have to have the shrooms. No, I can really go for some crab right about now. <laughs> I got That's some bonus for crabs. Can you imagine just scraping his bonus? I'm gonna go to the crustacean side. So. Okay, everyone shut the fuck up. Do you remember who you are? We remember, and we have a test for you. A riddle. You must remember. Listen carefully to my friend here. In this place, death, death comes before life. life. Yesterday comes after tomorrow. The summer comes after autumn. And then the chicken comes before the egg. Spend a few moments in silence to think, travelers. Nobody learned anything shouting over each other. Um? Can you repeat Could that? you repeat I the riddle? No I, I couldn't that hear riddle. I'll repeat yeah, it. The riddle is on it's Discord. Only in travelers chat. Oh, perfect. Oh. <laughs> Here we Okay. I am offended. Shouting over each other is a VR class tradition. In this place, death comes before life. Yesterday comes after tomorrow. The summer comes after autumn, and the chicken comes before the. If I like give you head time out, it's because. Is it the past? Is it the past? In this past. Sounds like the past. I think it's the future. Death comes before death comes before life. Hard life. <clears throat> oh yeah, it would be a dictionary. Because. Huh? Oh, Wait, a dictionary? 
Wait. Oh snap! A dictionary is perfect. I cannot take credit. Except for summer. Special does not come before autumn. That's perfect. If that's not the answer, I'm gonna be disappointed. A dictionary. Yeah. That's a perfect answer. But the summer does not come before autumn in a dictionary, so it's not a dictionary. That's clever. Oh wait, wait, what? No, it says the summer comes after autumn. Reread it. Reread it. Reread. No, no. Reread that. It says comes after autumn. How are you? Yeah. My bad. Oh, yeah, Never so mind. Autumn, yeah. yeah, that's perfect for dictionary. Whoa. Yeah. Before summer in the dictionary. Um, what's the riddle? What <laughs> is your enlightened answer, pilot? Dictionary. 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 Don't I got a big dick. Dictionary. A dictionary. Why are you hitting me? It is when you read between the lines of the great script in the sky that you learn where to find its holes. Take this jewel and let it assist you in the future, great pilot. We got the right answer. We got the right answer. Is it like the jewel? Yes. yes. I really hear him say correct. Oh, wait, wait, wait. 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 I can't see. Very good point. He didn't I, I say it. I don't see the jewel. I don't see, I don't see no, the jewel. jewel so. I don't see the jewel. It hasn't appeared yet. Oh, I think we just got to see the jewel. Give it a moment. Give it a moment. He's got to do its grand. The jewel's got to do its grand entrance. Yep. Yeah. Huzzah! Yoink. Yeah, it's grand entrance. Mermaid tear. And now it is here. Please. Oh, fitting. The mermaid tear. It's not in your the hand, boy. Crying? Please. I'm a mermaid. Did your ancient artifact. Because we're polluting the ocean. Good point. Good point. I'm just taking a picture of a dish. Click, click, click. My friends. The story continues. The unknown figure passes between the strange nightmare manifestations. They leave a jewel as they disperse. And the pilot passes and grabs hold of it. Something about this artifact, it's out of place. Something about it signals a call for help from someone trapped beneath an entire ocean. As they walk, there comes the scent of dust and rust. They look ahead, peering into shadows that feel distant, and a shape begins to take form. It is Colossal. It hangs in an abyss, majestic and imposing, as the figure perceives more and more of it. It has wings that cut through the darkness like great blades of night. And there it waits, motionless, refusing to be interpreted further expectant my friends please use the wake save point uh oh looks like we lost one there we go would you like to save your progress Gamer oh, whatever will i do right, back to the dub Hello, Zared. What if I'm doing a no-save run? Got a hardcore. Oh, I no, mean, man, you're still here. We call that Iron yeah, Man. Time to... Where's my chair? I know I knocked it. Time to Next get back to the, to, to, the, to the room that we paid seven for. Back to where we once did approximately one Seven memory blocks. Oh. So no, just seven. That's seven memory memory for, for seven, that's really good. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it wasn't the old days. <laughs> I'm stuck in the wall! <laughs> Back in my day. You got yourself into that mess, you can get yourself out. My friends. 
Here we go. The girl is jolted awake by a loud bang that shakes the room. A vase topples from the table and smashes on the floor. We have to go. Get dressed. We have to go now. The girl tries to explain to her mother about her nightmare, about how she knows what the person is searching for. The room shakes again, cracking the window this time. She stops mid-sentence when she looks through the broken glass. Its image is distorted, fragmented. It hangs in the night sky. It is here. The monster of the sky is here. It's following us! The little girl shrieks before tumbling from the bed, pushing herself up against the back wall of the room. There are sounds of a firefight outside the town. Don't look at it! The mother comes to grab her. It's going to be okay. Mama will protect you. But we have to leave now. The world comes down around them. Everyone, this way! Yes. I hope that nothing terribly happened to the town. That would be unfortunate. Oh, oh no, run. the town is on fire. Oh, really burning this time. Right. I'm too short. Cell, slow down. Eyes up. <laughs> Where did you, we all go? I'm too short. Go cell. So, go. I'm too, I'm too short. I can't see where the no idea where he's going. on your head. I think Sheen. Where are we going? Oh, there's Sheen. I, I see Sheen now, okay. We have the Sheen. Follow the squad. Slim Sheen D. This part of your... Uh... Oh boy, we took the short. Oh, oh no! no. Oh, oh, my oh, my God. God. oh my God! 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 Oh my no, Let no, me no, have see, this. See, it would be a shame if for protect, if you see, protect it doesn't do better. It's just a shame that I threw them it's all out It's just like yesterday. blowing into a Nintendo cartridge. Who the heck is protect? I will destroy you. Protect right down there. I know, but who is he and why is he stealing the spotlight? Why'd you throw away the batteries? Because all... he's our music bot and we love our music bot. Yeah. Attention. Yeah, friends. something of value was actually Perfect. lost. In the right. traveler's chat, there's a document continues. you want to open. Shh. It's the Evangelion. With daughter in tow, the mother makes her way to the town exit opposite the firefight. In the street, the mother spots a motorcycle lying on its side, still running. She goes to lift it upright. Halt! A large soldier appears, armed with a gun blade. The town of Shade is now under martial law, by order of the Grey. All civilians are to report for ether scanning. You two, come with me. The daughter holds her mother's hand tight. The mother states they were already scanned and have no potential. She slowly backs away. I said halt! The Soldier orders. He then presses a button on his visor. The mother sees this and pushes her daughter to run and hide behind a wooden crate. With a racing heart, the mother now stands defiantly between her daughter and the towering soldier. His eyes go wide as he reads his visor display. What's this? You haven't been scanned. You both are coming with me. Keeping eye contact with the mother, the soldier reaches for his comms, pre preparing to notify command of his discovery. The mother must think fast, and so begins your next quest. You have 30 seconds to decide, as a group, which of the three options to choose from. Attack, defend, or mother's instinct. 30 seconds. Times begins now. Yeah. 
Mother's instinct. 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 Mother's
Use water gun. The soldier raises the gun blade to the right, preparing for a sideways strike. Attack, defend, or mother's instinct. She has 30 seconds. Attack. 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 We must go on the offense and attack. 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 <laughs> Use left mouse button or... He has a From hell's heart, I stab at the... Attacks deal damage to your opponent, making it easier to get out. I like how you crouch, Michael. I dig it. Boom. <laughs> Attacking. What did you mean again? Really you that was a bad guy in your opponent. Now do it on your opponent. No kidding, Tricky. Attack, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> People die when they are killed. <laughs> He's ready to attack. I am not your opponent. Hmm, now, revelations over here. On your opponent. Five, four, three, <laughs> two, Good one. Job. Moon arc. Hello there. What will the mother do? What? Uh, attack. Mm -hmm. Hey, when did you get uh, said attack, didn't it? Uh, yeah, yeah, he said attack. She ducks attack. under the strike, then springs up to grab his still turning shoulder. Using his own weight and momentum, she shoulder throws him hard, head first in, onto the ground. He drops the gun blade on impact, and she quickly pins him down with her weight on his chest. She wails on him with all her might, wishing for each next hit to put him to sleep. But it's not enough. He soon grabs and throws her off. He doesn't let go and twists her left arm into a lock. She manages to unclip an incendiary grenade from his belt, but the angry soldier then brings his elbow down hard, breaking her arm at the wrist. The soldier has taken significant damage this round. Sheesh. Use leech seed. Witnessing all of this, the daughter screams for her mother. Now, positioned between them, the soldier grabs the little girl and lifts her by one arm. He locks eyes with the mother and growls for her to drop the grenade or he will kill her. The daughter shouts, leave us alone, just as a red aura erupts around her. Anger. Attack. Defend. Or mother's instinct. What will she do? Attack. Finish him. Red is angry. Attack. Press, attack. Attack. We attack. Press and hold the L Strike. and R buttons Use. to prepare and finishing attack. attack. Your finishing attack does mm, significant damage to your opponent and Are will help you knock them out. But beware, no if your finishing attack does not hit, attack. then you will be left Don't you hate tutorials? for a long time. <laughs> Gen 1 lead seed? Or Gen I'm sorry, or but you can't turn three. these off. Yeah. Yes, you can. It's called a mod. Not in this game. You delete, you delete all the voice files. You know how you turn off this tutorial is mute. <laughs> yep. I know how it's... Uh, it's in the newest action called suicide. <laughs> that was a great attack. Now do it on your opponent. Who knows what that little is about to do. Five, four, that was a great attack. Two, man. Don't, don't, don't one. Now try to defend. Evil, man. Fumble fingers. I'm not trying to. I Trigger attack my discipline, now, brother. Not Fumble <laughs> fingers. What Give will the mother now. do? Attack. Attack, you say? I thought she doesn't fumble. <laughs> and locks eyes with him. She takes a step forward, and the cowering soldier steps back and screams. The pure ether ignites into violet bolts, rapidly eviscerating his body 
and ending his life. Oh, Holy nice. shit. Pikachu, I told you you I told you Lord, have mercy. Not homicide. <laughs> There's no mercy here. That was fucking That's violent. <laughs> Great attack. I've now do it on your opponent. I've collected an mother approaches her daughter slowly. She is promptly knocked back by a wall of force. Calm down, Angel, she says. Slowly, the aura fades, and the daughter tries to cry, but is stopped by the horror she sees in the sky. The ground shakes. The dark monument now hovers over the town gates, dropping bolts of blazing fire in every direction. The mother grunts in pain as she lifts the bullet-riddled motorcycle into an upright position. She calls to her daughter to get on, but the girl stands unmoving, staring at the monster in the sky. Quickly, she pulls her daughter up on the seat with her. She still has one strong leg and arm. The adrenaline is masking the pain. For now. My friends, this way! Press and hold the A button to go forward. Holy shit. <laughs> That's gonna be some therapy. Oh shit. In the future. If the daughter is a waifu. If we get to go to ending. Waifu. That sound like a growl. Why does the motorcycle sound like Stop a here, growling man. dog? Stop here. I found you. Your tour guide is your choice of. Okay. <sighs> Aww. Aww. We'll just here then. <laughs> There's a Ren and Geo in the sky. Helicopter in the air. Or somebody mowing their lawn. Oh, never mind. It's in the car. I'm unsure why. They're just in their natural habitat. <laughs> My friends, just a few moments. We're waiting for everyone to gather. Apologies. One could even say their heads are just in the clouds. So I'm gonna fucking kill you. Can't <laughs> oh, <God>. kill me. <laughs> what does block you? Like the appraiser block you? My friends. Do you need more real They track? ride Shut for up. hours. Yes. Damn, you doing that? The trail is empty. The sound of the wind and the rumble of the engine slowly fade out in the mother's mind. All she can hear are her own thoughts alongside the painful thumps in her chest. The daughter holds on silently, eyes staring vacantly into the darkening sky. Angel, I'm so sorry. We are almost there. We will be at a safe place soon, the mother says. The daughter does not respond. This way. Well, that's disheartening. Yeah. Oh, yeah, but do it to you. Oh, oh, I do not like this caution sign. I wonder who that's for. <laughs> the sky is dark. The outpost looms ahead, various points of light moving about. The mother left the motorcycle on the road. It ran out of fuel a while ago. She leads her daughter by the hand struggling to breathe as they walk. Finally, they're somewhere safe. Finally, they can take a rest. And she can heal her. Wait. Something isn't right. This is meant to be a waypoint for smugglers. Why are there soldiers everywhere? Gray soldiers. The mother breaks down. 
She lets go of her daughter's hand and drops to her knees. This is hopeless. They can't escape. What is she even doing? The information from Shade was wrong. And it hurts. Everything hurts. The pain is almost unbearable. It's getting worse. Mama. The daughter's voice is tiny and feeble. Mama, are you okay? The mother looks at her daughter. You should sleep, Mama. I'll sleep too. And we can go to the dream world together. She takes hold of her mother's hand. I thought there were monsters there, but I know who it actually is. It's safe there. It's safe there, Mama. Let's go to sleep. Let's forget about this place. The mother listens to her daughter's words and begins to cry. She can't die here, and this poor child is already succumbing to the trauma. Her angel is losing herself. No. No. She has to be stronger. She has to make her own hope. The mother stands up, takes back her daughter's hand. She looks around. There has to be a way through here. My friends, this way. All right, time to solid snake it. To walk across the broom. You freaking got it, Earl. Oh, okay. God. No, the tutorial oh, is oh, boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> Uh, you fool! The tutorial. You I'm sorry, but I, I'm, so, I'm afraid I can't let you. Oh, I'm afraid I can't let you, Dave. Emerald. Hi, Emerald. Oh, I, I think that's enough for the tutorial. Yeah. That's the joke. We run it down in the ground. It was funny, but all right, yeah, that's fair. Like, that's we're, fair. Uh, yeah, we're at a critical uh, point where we want to focus more on the story. They stop and remain yeah. silent as two soldiers approach one another. They stop to talk, and the mother listens carefully. I, I'm sure you've heard, but Shade's been wiped from the map. Nothing left but ashes. He doesn't feel real, one soldier says with a worried tone. I'm not surprised. The Dark Monument is in the region, and Shade was a known supply point for the Ethos. But what if it comes here? They say it just destroys everything that's not a part yeah, of its Yeah, him. When's my friend? Look, he just joined. Uh, unlikely. That machine they excavated is here. It's scheduled for transport to District Zero. They would not destroy something this important. You mean... that creepy mech nobody is allowed to go near? Yeah. Rumor has it. There is an ether amplifier on board. The scanners can't make sense of it. That's impossible. I thought you can only fit those on big warships. Don't you need to grow them or something crazy like that? Well, whatever it is, I heard they can't get the mech to work. It fries any equipment we attach to it. What's with you? You want to see it? We can, before it ships out. Nobody is watching it now. Eh, no way. That thing gives me the creeps. The soldiers part ways to continue their patrols. Scooter. The mother concludes that the mech they spoke of is their only chance to leave this region. She looks at her daughter. The girl has been silent, staring vacantly at the wall since they have arrived. She wants to check if she's all right but they need to move. 
this way. Why did you bring with you Archvile? Huh? Yes, walk down through the center of the courtyard with all the soldiers staring at you. That's walk down. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Shh. You're gonna have to hop off before we end and go through here, though. Oh. oh! Hell yeah! Hey, uh, Nick, hey. Why is there a, 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 a weirdly placed mute right. button up there? Oh, oh no. get in the back. VR chat bug, what? VR chat bug. Oh, you have right. Not the right neck, though. In Doom 2, we have a little. It's a very simple. Oh, yeah, thing. I don't. I haven't watched it. Okay. Okay. Oh, the shotgun them. This is the purple one. Shotgun them. I'm not too angry. That's unfortunate. Avenge the arm. Okay. Avenge. Oh. No. Not even even there. Really? It's not. Yeah. Yeah. Man, I thought it was going down. Pretty much, yeah. Okay, You're on the right track of the mech, though. Get to the ship in the sky. Mm. As long as we get yeah, to the ship, we'll be so, in the community event. So it's not Evangelion. It's not Gundam. Mm. Freedom. Uh, Those are the only two I know of. I mentioned that yes. you're my favorite. What the heck? <laughs> I can't just be a mech. An excellent question. Give me a Why can't like, you just let it be a mech? Why does it have to be like. Develop its own My like friends, it can just develop its own style. Continues. Oh wow, they're all on that side. Sorry, I don't know what happens here. There <laughs> it stands alone. The magenta mech. The air is thick around it, drowning out sound, and somehow the glare of the night lights. This is our only chance. If there's anyone up there, please, help me. No, I can do this, the mother thinks to herself. It's warm to the touch. The cockpit eerily and silently opens. Not wasting time, the mother motions for her daughter to climb inside with her. But the girl refuses. The mother looks up and sees a guard in the distance slowly patrolling closer. She kneels down to her eye level and whispers in frustration that they need this to fly to where daddy is. The daughter backs away from her and the mech. She speaks with a quivering voice. No, that's not the right way. We we need to wait here. What? The mother is confused and tries to reach for her daughter. We have to go now. No, it's the pilot in the dream, Mama. We need to wait for the pilot, the daughter says louder as she backs away again. Angel, please, they are going to see us. I am the pilot, and we are going to fly this to where Daddy went. Get in now, please. No, we will be safe if we go to sleep, the daughter says louder, starting to cry. Stop, Angel, please. Calm down. She pleads with her right arm outstretched. I, I, I don't want to go in there again, Mama. The child shrieks. It's too late. A soldier on the wall shouts and triggers the intruder alarms. Sirens start blaring and the daughter panics, running into her mother's arms. Blinding spotlights quickly discover their whereabouts, illuminating the mother and daughter, holding one another under ghostly white light. The pilot will save us. The pilot will save us. The pilot will save us, she says over and over, before fainting in her mother's arms. The sirens continue to blare, and the soldiers are making their way down the walls. The mother looks at her daughter's unconscious face, then over to the magenta mech's open cockpit. It's completely 
pitch black. My friends, listen carefully. Due to your actions during the soldier battle, the daughter still holds her bunny doll as she sleeps. She also carries with her items into a nightmare. Due to these choices, she is able to she is not able to sleep soundly. And she is troubled, interrupted, and frightened by nightmares. The mimetic sensors in the Magenta Mac record her dreams, which are now available for review in the rendezvous. Please ask to check out the pilot dream text from Trajim's library should you wish to review. My friends, the mother struggles up the side of the mech, careful not to use her broken wrist directly. She manages to lift her daughter into the machine. She then climbs in with her. Please, click the still save point. Oh, hmm. we're not splitting. No pass split. That's different. Huh, that's yeah. weird. Hmm. Let's see. But did he solve the three meters the, the other time? Clicking a. Oh, this cockpit is giant. Why is like ants? Actually, no. It's probably because the mech is big. Actually, no. If you haven't already, I have. We got it. World volume. Oh, no, like, I've never no, been on no this problem. before. This has never happened before. <laughs> Wait, uh, this mech is a lot bigger on the inside. Do I have a guy that's big enough to sit in the chair? <laughs> it's got high board Wait, technology. Say that every time. Um, oh, god damn it! The one time I picked the TIA director's code and I can't use it. The one You're time. with that review. Th that's probably what the nightmare mm -hmm. review thing is for, so you know what it'll do. Read. Read got uh, to you. Know it succeeded, we'll see. Gio. You know it succeeded. And we got ourselves a new ending. I mean, I'm sure they wouldn't make an un- they wouldn't on, keep actually, an unusable item. Sure. It's somehow happening back. My friends, oh, I'll, the I'll story continues. There are items that are unusable. The mother secures the passenger seatbelt around her daughter. She readies herself in the pilot's seat and notices there are no movement controls. She places her right hand over her pounding, aching chest while frantically searching for a way to start this machine. Come on, please turn on, please. It can in like this, she thinks. Suddenly, the dashboard lights up. An automated voice speaks. Initiating startup sequence. Mimetic drive connected. Scanning for contact identity markers. Negative. Unregistered pilot detected. Please input ether engine access code. My friends, you have 15 seconds to give the access code. The access code is... You don't know the access code, do you? The access code no. is Emeralda Kessel. This might lead into Emerald like a new Kessin? bad ending. Emerald Kessin. 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 Jay. Jay knows it. Jay knows it. Yes. Jay knows it. Don't worry. Who's Jay? I thought it was going to be the <laughs> boy. Jay Who is Jay? Yeah. What the heck? Yeah. Jay Monkey. You know That'll the passcode? Oh. Big boy in yes. The All right. Tell the passcode. I'm ready, Sheen. Time has expired. My friends, who among you knows? Ether engine access code. J Monkey. J Monkey. J Monkey. J Monkey. Does. J Monkey. Yeah, J Monkey. It is. It is Emeralda Kessin. J Monkey, I kindly ask that you share how you know this with the others after the tour is over. I will. 
<laughs> All right, showtime. It's boss Let's time. do this. No, this is boss. I hope you know what you're doing. No. Let's rock and roll. Mini people. boss. <laughs> Mini bus. Major encounter. Well, so we're going to get a new ending this time. All systems go. Yeah. I guess first time I've been on this side. I think we used to go that way. <laughs> the daughter. Suddenly shouts in her sleep. Speaking a name the mother does not recognize. The computer responds. Access granted. Igniting ether engine. Welcome back, Holy Mother. Holy Mother? The magenta mac begins to levitate. Initiating healing drive. The mother's heart is stabilized. Yes! Warning. <laughs> Eight hostile lock-ons detected. The mother's mind is that shown is cool. four combat techniques. Heaven's Fist, Divine Impact, Holy Choir Storm, and Grand Cathedral Ray. Holy she has 30 things to choose. All right, okay. so one is I'm one is for okay, so we're doing with four enemies. Do one is for AOE. destination. One is for what are the choices again? For enemy destruction, and one is oh, you know what? Oh, there they are. Oh, there they are. I say, let's go. There you go. That's a lot of them. They're using. There are eight. They're using double team. Let's just kick some ass. Or not. That we need, need a little of AOE. I feel like there are more. Actually, yeah. Holy Choir Storm is an AOE. Where are you going with another? Like an AOE. Like an AOE. No uh, alert. Fire Everything storm. is an AOE. Please send it to me. Yes, it's, it's true, but <laughs> it's... <laughs> This part is just so. Oh will all God. moves work, or will only what? Or this is like all the other fights where only one move does works properly. Every action ever done. Kind of like will be some kind of uh, we've won battle this from an unsaid game. Uh, oh, so we, so we just, in which I yeah, have to work. Cool yeah, yeah. yeah. This is the victory lap. Hey guys, I have an idea. Guys, I have a. I have already determined who has a dice. These are few. I have a, I have a time has expired. Um, no what we okay, do. Black Hold Flame. Up, we have a D4. Black I Flame. Guess. Two. What? There are eight <laughs> enemies attacking from the Grey Army. What will the Mother do? Heaven's Fist. Heaven's Fist. Is that correct? Yes. I don't remember the other attacks except Heaven's Fist. The Magenta Mech. Raises its arm skyward, and a golden lightning bolt strikes the fist. The mother moves into a warrior's stance as golden arcs crackle down the body. On the offensive, she tears into the center of their formation with a flurry of brutal combos, and ending with a thunderous uppercut, which sends the entire group flying. Jesus! Jesus. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Rock and roll, motherfucker! Enemies remain. Ether amplifier charged 10%. Round 2 begins. Something tells me we need to get that. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the? More. An alert goes off in the cockpit. Warning. Twelve hostile lock-ons detected. The Grey Army attacks. What will the mother do? You have 30 seconds. Holy choir storm. Uh -huh. I want to see the choir storm. Holy choir storm. Choir storm. Choir storm. Magenta mech. You saw choir storm. I'm going to see fire and be like, oh god. After so many months. 
<laughs> of us getting our butts kicked by these guys. It's so cathartic to just see them just all get wiped in one turn. Jesus Christ, yes. Imagine how we felt. Imagine how we felt doing this in real time. The first time. Oh, yeah. I, 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 I wish I was there. It's like when you skip a bug catcher in Pokemon and come back after you beat the Elite Four. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. I'm specific. I'm not wrong. Who said that? That's the exact thing you're next. Feeling. I'm calling on you. Hi, I made a Pokemon reference. Time has expired. Emerald of Doom. What will the mother do? Twelve enemies are attacking. Uh, Holy Choir Storm, or whatever it was called, the, the choir one. Understood. You heard the man. Thank you. The magenta mech ascends high, disappearing into the storm above. Bright yellow light begins flashing rapidly from within the thunderheads. With a loud crash of thunder, the mother rockets down from the sky, covered in golden ether bolts. Her wings. Mimic a chorus crescendo through the wind as she rams headfirst into the group, decimating the enemy. <laughs> Enemies remain. Ether amplifier charged 10%. Wait, it's still 10%? Wow. We're up to 26%. We're at 20? Oh, enemies are the other two? Something tells me that yeah, this thing will end once we get to 100%. I mean, you either. gotta think, we're barely charged up and we're kicking the aces. <laughs> True. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> An alert we gotta charge up our final form. An alert goes off in the cockpit. Warning. Four. Hostile lock-ons detected. The gray army oh, wow. attacks. What will the mother do? Oh, let's do the please. ray. Where's the ray? Floor. Let's do the fucking the, the ray. Grand Cathedral. Let's just do ray. freaking. <laughs> yeah, that one. Let's yeah, just ray. do freaking yeah. ray. Like, can I imagine? What was the second one, though? What was the second ray. one? We got Heaven's Fist. Divine Impact. Divine Impact. Thank you. Yeah, no, Holy Cathedral, ray. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Drop the entire church on them. <laughs> Five seconds. In the name of God, we go to heaven. In the name of God, we go to heaven. And drop a giant ass Bible. Hello, Tack. What will the mother do? Focus, Tack. Pick the bean. Uh, the F-word is not an option, although I wish it was. Cathedral Ray. Is that correct? I'm just saying. Yes. The kid's mom is kind of a baddie. Well, you're ahead of me on that. The magenta mech. <laughs> Not your average soccer its mom. Hands together, as if in prayer, an enemy charges and swings at the mother's head. Get rid of it. The giant sword hits only air <laughs> as her after image fades in place. The soldier looks up to witness his now airborne foe encased in a golden ether vortex. The mother's heart beats with the warrior's song. The wings stretch wide. She prays only to herself for the strength to save her daughter. The metal hands open toward all that would harm her angel. And she answers her own prayer with divine retribution unto the entire Grey Army.
<laughs> yeah, this pick is fucking scary. Nothing personnel. I fucking love this. <laughs> and it's on like, our side, like the final, it's like the <laughs> yeah. Okay, <laughs> now someone turn this mech into an avatar. Exactly. Yes. Oh, it don't is. worry, someone will. Nick. Yeah, can someone give me a glass of that? I will do it in one day. I have returned. Nick. I was just doing a fiasco with my dog. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh. It didn't work. Why are there more? Oh, it's all over. <laughs> we, we might have a few more. They're basically throwing <laughs> everything they have kick. at us in a desperate attempt to merely slow us down. What? Yeah, yeah, exactly. An alert. Fair fight. An alert goes off in the cockpit. Warning. I've read. 16 hostile lock ons detected. Ooh. The oh. Grey Army attacks. What will the mother do? 30 seconds. 16 ooky numbers! Yeah. yeah. Alright, so we haven't done yeah. the impact yet, so let's do that. Yet. Dude, the only Dude, thing I haven't thing? done yet. Divine impact. Divine impact. Divine impact. Divine impact. Divine let's see what that does. Well, we haven't seen. Divine impact. Make a crater. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, yes. Also known in D D circles as Smites. <laughs> Yes, my. <laughs> okay. I'm not a talent oh, class. I'm a sorcerer class. Divine smut. Let's see. Someone that I've called on before, but I've not called on in a very long time. Time has expired. The <laughs> rad misfit. Hello there. What will the mother do? Yes. Divine impact! Yay! <laughs> the Magenta Max wings extend as it begins charging up with ether. She swings a leg high, then brings it down hard, striking the earth. The shockwave travels underground, then explodes upward under the enemy group in a burst of molten rock and ether. <laughs> the group <laughs> is obliterated. I mean, Earthquake is. is... Oh my God, slide, I slide. Super effective to steel types. Amplifier charged, ten percent. Ooh, twenty percent now. Thirty. Actually. We didn't so go. Oh, Thirty. <laughs> Let's go. No, we're I think it's been charging ten percent right. each round. Of the way there. I'm pretty sure yeah, we're at four rounds right? to go, people. Yeah. Well, seven rounds to go I now. Like this I did not. It's just been charging way. by ten percent every round we've gone. Celestial thing. Yeah. So that means My we got friends. a lot more rounds to go. The mother fights on. Honorably, bravely. She defends her daughter. She defends her life, and her heart beats strong with her. As she continues this battle, the Grey Army continues to grow. My friends, let's check on the daughter. Please, this way. What? Oh. What? Excuse me, what? Oh, it's over. Putting up a lot. The mother's literally just gonna carry the fight for us. Alright. Did not expect to be daughter just kind of been watching. Yep, uh. Like, just. Oh dear. Pokemon battle. Okay, where's Sinistar? The mother prepares yeah, to face the next wave. When out of nowhere, a fiery red beam strikes down from the clouds. She narrowly dodges it as the surrounding area is annihilated. She looks up through the smoke to witness the abominable airship finally show itself. Not even in this powerful mech would she stand a chance. The mother thinks. Okay, what the fuck? It will shoot her down if she runs, and the soldiers block her path to attack. What does she do? Is this the end? Suddenly, an alarm goes off in the cockpit. 
Warning. Phase space logic rewrite detected. Class 7 anomaly approaching at extreme speed. What? What now? The mother questions. Another ship? Not the Dark Monument? This... this ether reading is impossible. The mother turns to check on her daughter. Safe. Asleep. Wha what's happening? She has no time to think, as she is engaged by the advancing Grey Army. My friends, before the sun rises, let's join the daughter in a new dream. A new dream? Mm. Certified gamer moment? <laughs> dream, not nightmare. Oh boy. <laughs> Yep, um, let's get this bread. Uh oh. My oh, friends, please click on the fluttering <laughs> save point. <laughs> what? You Excuse me, what? It's Undertale's barrier. The pillar. Oh my god, it's Alice's face. Hey. I don't, 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 get the fuck don't, back don't, here. Go away! Hey. Get back here, we're not supposed to go there yet. <laughs> You're welcome. Oh, it's not you fucking elevator! <laughs> I think they realized. Yeah. Just like one I was gonna try and hide behind it. Come on back, come on back. Nope. Oh. Oh. Sorry, I thought I the was figure. Lights in an hour, you're not supposed to go to the air. Go to the gate. The figure feels the ground rise to their feet. Their senses come together one by one. Aware once again. A warm light greets their eyes. The shine splits the darkness. The figure steps into it, and the cold void quietly falls away. My friends, let's follow the figure into the light. Please, walk ahead of me. I will follow behind the group. Undertale's barrier. Man, it looks like I'm on drugs. Entry. Hey, look, it's the bank vault to the Shadow Realm. Hey, Drassel. Oh, there's a, there's a ram. Okay. If we fucked him, I'll blame Jigo. Exactly. Can you look for a fucking ram? That's, um... That's Ragnarok. Yeah, Jigo. It's Ragnarok. Yep. Okay. This is me. Hey, Ren, is this your bank vault? No, it's the asset vault. <laughs> no, it's the door. Wait, it's the it's here, I can't get through it. <laughs> An otherworldly tree sits. Another worldly tree sits bathed under sacred white light. The figure's mind struggles to understand the infomorphic structure perceiving it as a gate. Waiting patiently nearby is the familiar shimmering heart. Its colors friendly, innocent, wholesome. The gate opens and the heart flutters through. The figure follows. Oh, that's the cool. Doobies. Awesome 100 Keanu Chung yeah. moment. Oh, okay, that is significantly cooler than last time, I think. We're going oh oh my god, I was right. Um. <laughs> Where the I fuck are we? I can't we? not be hyped. <laughs> <laughs> 
I, I think we're in the Shadow Realm. It's impossible. Do not oh no, we're somewhere really to the game point. Do not walk. This is what happens. No, this is... God damn it. Let us get in the How can I get out of here? Who deleted my save file? Who is it? the realm between. There is no escape. God damn it. Nobody's saying anything, though. So you're saying we will be fucking each other, right? Wait, what if we went down a pipe in Mario and now we're in the cave bubbles? Are you that tired? <laughs> this place. <laughs> oh boy. This place. <laughs> the figure thinks <laughs> while placing their hand <laughs> on <laughs> the metallic wall. Mm -hmm. Their thoughts stop. They move quickly to explore. This way. Follow the cube. I I can't absolutely love how excited when I'm here. I fucking love how giddy Diablo is getting. What is this? A hanger? I see. I see some walls. Of a sword. Hanger. I hardly know her. No, please. Why I feel so tiny? Do I have to choke someone it looks now? It's like one of the starter houses in the original Animal Crossing. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, we did go upstairs. Oh, I actually went the right way. I was curious. <laughs> oh, I don't want to explore too, but like, I can't think. I'm like, what's upstairs? <laughs> That's the whole point. Oh, just click on this. Oh. Hype. That's a, I can't even tell this. Oh, wait, wait on the cube of guidance, friend. Uh, oh, God, we're going to his elevator right now. This is the pathway. <laughs> Uh -huh. uh, you know, honestly, I can't help but be hyped too because, like, I know what this is. <laughs> this isn't this the agent. Is the <laughs> tour. Trust me. Hey. Beautiful. Ah, I hate stairs. Are we gonna no. fight Metal Gear? Stairs. Oh, Metal Gear. Which one? Hey, more like the agent. hey, hey. Oh, this blocks. is the agent. Wait, Trust me, this isn't the agent. Not the agent. Um, it's no. This... How is this not the pros, Mac? No. This no, it's not. Man for all your time. This room is very oh, different from that room. It's not in the ink. It's not in the face. This place. We fight in soon. Once. Hey, look, guys, it's oh, face. We're fighting that boss. I was going to get the other guy. I know what you're talking about. We're not fighting. We don't need to anymore. Oh, he jumped off. Alright then. Whoops. <laughs> Let's just hope we go. The figure enters the heart of this space. <laughs> A powerful engine sleeps before them. Hmm. I've been here. I've seen this room alive. Their eyes focus on a slot at the center of the console. Still carrying the ether crystal, they hold it up, looking into it. For the first time, the figure sees their own reflection. It's... It's the good thing to do, she says, and places the orange crystal into the engine. Her heart beats once. She remembers. Her heart beats once. The engine ignites. Her heart beats once. She notices her flight suit. Sorry. Her heart beats once. She remembers the legend. Once upon a time, there was... An invincible vessel. From the depths, it rises. Over the oceans, it shines. Through the skies, it soars. Manifesting through 10,000 stories made real. The legendary ship comes true. 
and the pilot dashes to the bridge. My friends, this way. <laughs> Let's go. I love for the armor guys. Oh, this is oh, this is... Oh, first, can I stop for a second? This is where we go. Oh, this is where we go. Hey, yo, we missed the it's bar. Onwards to <laughs> glory. Quickly now, friends. There's a fight to win. That was a very Spoilers. interesting path. If you can go on, Terrence. Well, I mean, Woo! like. We gotta fight the dark monument somehow. Oh, oh. oh no, it's a lost his elevator. Oh, man. Let the chaos begin. All hands on deck. Oh no, you're not fighting. Alright, I'm gonna be the one who controls the guns. I choose the role of bobblehead on, on the console. I will be the bobblehead. <laughs> yeah. Thank you for the moral support. Bobblehead. Bobble 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 I forget what his name is. I'm the lower class chick. I'm the gun man. Exactly why you're not doing it. All right, gun lover. I got a bit lost. <laughs> gun button. <laughs> Would you like to initiate sound effects? It's a good song. No. Initiate D's protocol. <laughs> oh shit. I don't remember what he said. I just don't remember that he's in the sound effects menu. <laughs> I'm actually worried for these people. We might get the bad ending again. Hey, can can don't you get off my it. gun lever? That's what I. That's what he used to fire the gun. I'm like specifically on gun duty. Like, wave high to. You're, you're gonna Elon. prematurely so fire the gun. <laughs> it, it, I, I, I can't reach it. My arms are too short. Man, I'm enjoying. Is I'm enjoying this music. I didn't need it. I wasn't. That, that's nice. Yeah. You think you're I'm short? I'm like not. I'm short. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna act like I know what that means in retrospect, in like, in comparison to customary I can whatever. Like to be that small. Oh, okay, I got it. Got it. Does it come Magic. with problems? Yeah, that's about my Magic. Short. I can't Magic. see past my face. Like but... minus two feet. I can't see with robotic on top of me. <laughs> exactly. That's why I tried Perfect. to do that, but it doesn't change. Robotic can see just fine, though. Gun lover. Yeah, I, I can direct. Apologies, um, friends. We had a few people that crashed and we're getting them back here. I beg your patience. I'm not surprised right, so. I froze up. That's long. That's completely. No, don't fine. beg, demand the patience. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I do abort. Do you like that? I don't want to break it. <laughs> Ooh, what does this I mean, red button do? Ship. No. <laughs> That's the stuff. All right, button. my friends, the I'm story continues. The memetic sensors are set off as the travelers enter the bridge. <clears throat> huh? Hey, Wait, travelers? Ship? Anomalies on the bridge? Where? I don't see anyone. The sensors say it's... They're all around me. Wait. Oh, it, the travelers. It's you, isn't it? Oh, let's see. If I increase the amp range of the ether crystal field... Yes. Okay. Hello? Travelers, can you hear me? Hello there! Yes, we can hear you! I'm amplifying this ether crystal with a little bit Glad to see you again, pilot. I thank you for allowing me on this. Congratulations for breaking the fourth wall. You probably couldn't break any more. We're diegetic. We did it. Yeah, don't worry, I'm keeping it stable. Screw walls. I hear you. Yeah, oh, there's walls so are many of you. I use Indeed. Pillars. Travelers, I can really hear you. I do have snacks, and yes, Geo, I can hear you. <laughs> Yes! Oh, shit. <laughs> 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 you could name Gio, but not me! I'm the Elmer Man, gosh darn it! You will remember- 
girls are behind him. Be. The L man be taking The L man, all of you. I can see and hear all of you. Thank you all so much. I knew you were real. I am the pilot, and welcome to my legendary ship. It's okay, travelers. Legendary. It sure is. Now listen up. It's about time I got a crew. There's a brave little girl out there who needs all of us. A real nasty thing known as the Dark Monument is making a mess of her world. I made a promise as a pilot that I can't let things like that fly. And I think all of you travelers did too. So, how about it? Good pun. Will you be my crew for the legendary ship? Absolutely. Yeah. It would be an honor. Yes. I may not know my past, but I know who I am now. A traveler that helps those in need. Go right this time. My only request is to get some breakfast. Let's do it. Shut up. Let's kick some butt. No, do not ask that right now. Keep that later. What about the okay. dental plan? The vanilla I mean, A traveler that helps yeah, those in need. And yes, we will take down the dark monument and we will kick butt. Your past doesn't matter here. All that matters is that we save this story. Right then. All right, crew. We're going to blast that monster out of the sky. To your battle stations. Fasten your seatbelts and prepare for takeoff. Finally, it's time to fly. I hope. Let's go for the vanilla extract. Four extract. All right. On to this tension. I've got, I've got sound tests. Sound test menu. <laughs> well, I mean, I My friend, someone who's please, please be enabled. Yes, please click yes, the yes, pilot yes, the legendary yes, ship yes. save point. Let's go. We meet again. Ship. Oh. Oh. Get your weapons ready, friends. This is going to be a legendary battle. <laughs> that many <laughs> shall remember. That's bad. So, Dark Monument. Ah, uh, let's do this. More than that. that mother is going oh. down. Why is he using it? No, no, I mean, like, uh, <laughs> it's fine. Uh, <laughs> it's fine. So many weapons. I'm, I'm too forward. forward to see, so we're going to have to Crew, go. Forward. Oh, forward on the ship. My friend, this way. This way. Oh, let's go. Okay, don't Just give Bezos the, ideas. I've never seen them here before. The, Did you say Jeff Bezos? Who said I Jeff Bezos? I get to control the gun. Enemy off the port bow! So, Dark Monument. We need a gun. Alright, who said that? I want to control We got the an attack in the poop deck! <laughs> me. Take this little shit! Who said it? All right. Wrong kind of shit! Yeah, yeah, it right. it was me! Equal as me! Friends, gather around. Hey, we have a plan? Good news, I don't see any cannons on the other ship. Yes, tomato. Now we got a few. We've had a few yeah. Gatling guns. We have a plan. The legendary Attack. ship flies high and true, closing in on the outpost. In a thunderous flyby, the pilot fires on the gray army. Accepting the challenge, the dark ship of terror rises from the clouds and gives chase. And thus, travelers, your final battle, airship. Versus airship begins. The pilot shouts oh, out to travelers. Oh. Travelers, are you ready? Absolutely. Yes. Yeah. 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 We better have good medical if this goes poorly. We shall kick this ship's posterior. As long as I get to control the gun, I'm hopefully in. everything will go You'll right be this able time. To decide your fate. Hopefully. Wait, what? So right. Hopefully. The engine. Gun happy. What do you mean this time? Don't last know time didn't go so great. Oh god. Oh fuck. And here we go. Travelers, right. this way. Oh, wait a minute. That's All different. Right. That's a different starting different order. point. Different order? Oh shit. Oh wait, I think I know, but I think we'll get what, what, what it is. I think we need a different order. Can move around guns. But I think that I don't think it matters. I think we we can do the same set of things. It's just a matter of finding what goes yeah. with what. Yeah, I I did specify we shouldn't do it based on the round number. We should do it based on my friends. The, the dark monument soars overhead. Now port side of the legendary ship. Okay. The pilot has options to choose from. 
Fire torpedo. Fire ether cannon. Evasive maneuvers. Charge up the ether amplifier. Heavy artillery. An overdrive shift. You have 30 seconds to choose. Ooh. Uh, That's quite a lot of them. Just we follow what the rat has put on this card. Probably, but like, probably evasive maneuvers. Oh! No, 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 Yes. I'm yes. Hoping. We always yeah, listen to the rat. He's always wise ball. and correct. The arm is just kind of, the arm is so Pito is himself, not so good until they're him. beneath yeah. us. Okay. Yeah, he's oh, all. This is actually so, coming from yeah. me. Yeah. Travers had a leader. Yeah. 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 Is it my army either cannon? Oh, it literally oh. says so you were all the rat's guidance. The arm is not in the front. It's been three hours this event this time. Um, some information. Where are all these weapons placed? I think that's very important. I don't have time. Port right starboard. Right um, oh, that might be the artillery. I don't know. Oh dear. Time Let me just ask him to use oh. that weapon that's right there. Diarmid. Noble. <laughs> Courageous. Wise. Diarmid. What will the pilot do? <laughs> Fire the ether cannon. <laughs> Fire the ether okay. cannon. And I hope this works. Okay, so. Fuck! <laughs> uh. <laughs> <laughs> Are these uh evasive maneuvers? The thing. The pilot oh. prepares to fire the ether cannon, but before she can act, I the dark it. monument <laughs> fires a harpoon into the hole, which oh immediately goes taut as the legendary ship is dragged through the air. The pilot <laughs> loses control and is dragged okay. against the wind. Yep. The dark yeah. monument accelerates. Really and sick. turns sharp, it's fine. swinging the legendary ship into a giant mountainside. Oh god, no. Creaky, no. oh, no. assistance, I can't hold- I, I can't no. balance on the edge here. Oh, no. so oh, no. no. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, it's gonna do something really funny there. Oh, wow. Um, um, Jason. Yeah, oh, dear. As we just fly through it. That seems so nice. No, that wasn't. Okay. The legendary ship takes heavy damage. When they're at the front of the ship. That's when I said. Ah! Jesus, man. Right. Trying to analyze. Now, I. I just. Artillery. Artillery. Wait, 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 wait. Why are the artillery people's names over there? No, hold on. I've only just realized that I've been muted for the entire. Let's see what the ship does. This way, friends. Oh my god. Over here, guys. Over here. Over here. So you can hear him. Okay, okay hmm. so. <clears throat> I mean, this is pretty much. We fire at back at him, right? No. Oh, he's he's going down. down. Oh, no. oh, come on. Okay. Okay. Come on. Torpedo. 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 Yes, exactly. This is what I'm saying. Wait, did we invade the ship? This is. Imagine if we could. Imagine if we could. That would be cool. The dark <laughs> monument dives below the clouds, out of sight. The following options are available to the pilot Fire torpedo. Evasive maneuvers, charge up the ether amplifier, heavy artillery, and overdrive shift. You have 30 seconds. Torpedoes! Torpedo. Alright, so here we should have the torpedo. Torpedo! 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 I hope they're seeking torpedoes at least. Uh, torpedoes. Well, it's our only weapon that seems, well, from the sounds of it, that is on the underside of the ship. We're torpedoing. It's his torpedo. Yeah, we're torpedoing. So basically, we're torpedoing. Yes, oh, I wish yes I that is that, that's that a term. That's bit. that's a word. Torpedoing. We're torpedoing, right? It is now. Yes. yes. 
Torpedo I have coined it. Fire thy torpedo. There it shall be. Five seconds. Hey, I'm the one who said it first. Torpedo. No, I said it first. Torpedo. torpedo. I don't go for the torpedo. Really How is it the I won't try to do The torpedo goes Tiny down. Tiny Foxtrot. Yes. What will the pilot do? Torpedo. Fire yeah. the torpedo. <laughs> the pilot prepares to fire a torpedo. But before she can act, the legendary ship is bombarded like with bolts of plasma fire from below. What? That was the wrong oh. 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 How the huh. fight? Interesting. Really? The torpedoes go forward and you can't even see the target. It was the wrong answer. Ah, ah, so 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 ah, this is the one for me. Oh, no. you okay? When You're taking they, quite the blast. And this is why I you thought think? we used the ether. Actually, so this you is just extremely painful. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Are you okay? Are you okay? This is extremely painful. Oh, oh, I, oh, I can probably good. heal you. I got a little bit of a, a healing HP. function. Wow, so the torpedo was the wrong answer. I have a healing function in I this guy. I am recording this. That's that's nice. torpedo. So, uh, we need to work. We need to go back. Jeff Bezos is back. Let's get him. Like oh, all right, right, you should be at full health. I think they're all evasive maneuvers at this point. My friends, you listen carefully. So much ether I have on me right now. The dark monument goes silent, showing no change in flight path, no movement. The pilot has 30 seconds to choose from the following options. Evasive maneuvers, charge up the ether amplifier, heavy artillery, or overdrive shift. Uh, heavy artillery. Yeah, we know this I word, heavy artillery. No, no, this isn't heavy, heavy No, no, this oh, is not the heavy oh. artillery. This is where we should charge. Oh, okay. Wait, charge the, wait, we don't, we okay, can only charge the thing if it's not to do anything. It's when they're close to us. Charge the ether amplifier. We should use the heavy artillery. Charge the thingy. I thought we were charge the thingy. I say Ethan's our amplifier. They're taking a turn at a break. We're going to take a turn of work ourselves up. So, last time. We must press every advantage we have. Because we're kind of losing hard right now. Ah, yes. Uh, yes. So, uh, so uh, we we like, like, uh, artillery. So we're supposed to charge it, though, right? But the thing is, is that we're, we're, still, like we're still learning well, stuff. I mean, theory. fair enough. We thought, yeah, that, we thought that we got it all sorted out last time, but clearly I not. I have a feeling with how much so, we failed, the, the bad ending is an inevitability. Why don't we sacrifice somebody to the pilot Probably. mods so that well, we have better luck? We'll see. Five seconds. We're currently connecting us to the pilot. That's it, I the results. Their amplifier. Yeah. Man, this is the second time we've done th gone through it, so we don't know the exact time has expired. So. Kitty, Kitty, what will the pilot do? Charge of the ether cannon. Come on, charge ether of the ether cannon. Ether amplifier. Charge of the ether amplifier. Uh, uh, what, 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 what are you doing? doing sign, sign, language? sign language in VR chat. Oh. That's crazy. Oh, they're mute. Charge. Kitty, can you write your answer in our Discord? Uh, they said charge. Oh, oh boy, I'm scared. Oh, someone, Please someone read sign language. That's convenient. Charge. Is that correct, Kitty? Yes. Charge of the ether cannon. He yes. signed I yes. I understand. It's either amplifier. Or not. I mean, nodding. Charge up. Seizing the I'm opportunity to redirect power, the okay. pilot charges the really ether amplifier. Good. Just after she presses the button. She is hit with a sudden mimetic attack, which knocks her to the ground. Well, we managed to do it this time. That's Wait. the important part. She recovers and takes back the wheel. It's a success. The, the ether ramp is now <laughs> fully charged. Right answer. Oh, oh, fully charged. Okay. Oh, that's oh, fully okay. charged. I think the ether, Ooh, we get a super I think the ether cannon is is the thing that comes yeah. from this, actually. <laughs> Yes, most likely. <laughs> I.e. the ether no, cannon uses easy. the ether amplifier. No, I think yeah. the ether cannon will be something else. Maybe. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, oh, we're back to see yeah, real quick. <laughs> Overdrive shift for this one, probably. I'm excited. Yeah. That is evasive maneuvers. Or is that... No, actually. Yeah.
There's myself. Yeah, that way. Oh, that's right. There's an invisible ramp. Bro, if you can see it on the ship. What the hell are you doing? A traitor! A traitor! I did say it! The mad last time I worked at home! The dark monument moves toward the start, trailing behind the legendary ship. The pilot has available the following actions. Evasive maneuvers. Heavy artillery and overdrive shift. You have 30 seconds. I feel like overdrive shift. Overdrive shift. Overdrive shift. Overdrive shift. Overdrive shift. Yes. Oh, we're gonna be taking a few more hits because we've got some. Make them eat plasma. The sky battle returns. Fast travel that resets that thing back. We can at least confirm that this is the tour where we had to do it perfectly. So we can uh, in. true. Oh yeah, no. I, mean, I think yeah. I think we've got this in the bag. So what's the difference between the uh, overdrive and shift and evasive enemy. maneuvers? What's the difference? Um, I think um, evasive maneuvers is like moving side to side to dodge attacks. Overdrive shift is We're trying you to... just need to go really fast. Overdrive shift is basically oh, oh, really fast. Fast. You go so mm. fast that they have no time to attack. Oh, they plan to ram. Then yeah, you Actually, speed up. About it, if we just go fast, yeah, yeah. So yeah. Like, yeah. shoot get us out. Overdrive shift stops. Yeah, yeah, I think we're yeah, doing it to the end of the last time. Because I changed over to the middle of the way. Yeah. 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 I found out something yeah, unfortunate it. about this yeah. map. I did the fast travel back to the sky battle and that reset the dark monument time on my screen. Jesus, what, what do you see? Jesus, <laughs> maiden. What will the pilot do? Overdrive shift. Overdrive shift. Overdrive shift. Hoo -ah. Overdrive shift. Come on. Sorry, is the Upa Wait, compulsory with the overdrive shift? Like overdrive shift pa. Maybe. Okay. Overdrive shift, right? Would you say overdrive okay. shift? I think the dark say monument. <laughs> the dark <laughs> monument accelerates to oh. ram the stern. But it's met with explosive fire from the legendary ship's thrusters. Bye, have a good time. <laughs> Not Great. exactly what I expected. That's what, you, that's what you get for trying to fender bender uh, us. Anyway. This way, friends. Does the mo dark monument take massive damage? What are you doing? Oh, Fine. You're a spider. <laughs> 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 yeah. Coffee, yeah. Uh, I'm literally back. <laughs> the animation for it ramming us was really cool, right? Because it took forever to animate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could see it, but apparently using the fast travel and sky battle resets the, uh, Right. Uh, so we got two right. the battle animation. The evil ship. That's good. Yeah. I mean, it's not like it's not like the mountain took three months or anything. <laughs> what? Oh my god! Oh, oh, I, I, feel I, feel I feel your pain. I mean, I, oh my god! That battle's going on, which was very well worth it, especially with bugs. Ugh. This is. I hope we're doing better. Come on! That's exactly what I want. I'm still needing. We have two successes this round, which is better than last time. I heck, I'm gonna throw you too at this point. We still took damage in one of those successes. Let's hope it's a three strike. Your attention, please. The story continues. Continues. Suddenly, the pilot calls out to the travelers. Hello? Travelers, listen, I need your help. The sensors are picking up troops mobilizing inside the dark monument. They are going to try to board us. I can divert power to the ether crystal's field effect for 60 seconds. I won't be able to move the ship. But it should be enough for you to interact with this narrative and fight. Travelers, I believe in you. Be brave. Oh, I'm getting here. Oh, it is. Oh, we're going to go kick some butt. 
fan oh, clickers so right now. Yes. Yes. Let's, Let's kick some ass. Let's kick some ass. We're no longer it's passive. Oh, there we go. Okay, what are we should do it. If you click so, oh, you can hit the punch It's gonna drop through. All right, let's kick some tail. Okay, I think my drip. You can interact with them. Let's go. Click on them. Click on them really fast. Fan click. Fan click. Let's go. Oh, thank you. Aha! My drill was strong enough to take down that thing. Oh my god. Um, arrow there. Go around. Pikmin. Just mashing in the west. <laughs> oh, I'm loving the reaction. No, you don't. Oh, no, I do. Die! I don't think I see any more. Anyway, that easy. How am I going to need robotic? <laughs> Man, I'm slow. Ah, I've fallen to my death at least four times. I think I'm all good. No, I didn't. Ah, back attack! Any more baddies? I think we got them all. Uh oh. I'm gonna see if I got any on my got my I got everything, so or at least for me. <laughs> Alright, Thrill King, how many did you kill? I killed ten. Uh, yeah, I'd say so, yeah. Yeah, yeah the giant mech so ship appears it's secure, Commander. I didn't kill them huh. with my glass. Oh. Ooh. Oh, your leggies. What'd you kill them with? Glare. Glare. For once, I actually Glare. use my keyblade as a weapon. Oh. <laughs> don't exist anymore. There we go. This difference. Oh. It's all thanks to my Ten, oh. nine, oh. eight, seven, six, five, oh. four, three, two, oh. one. Travelers, gather around. Well done. The travelers defeat the troops. And successfully protect the legendary ship. <laughs> Did you know that you know they can pierce the heavens? Yes, <laughs> success. Ooh. <laughs> no one could withstand Get this my awesome <laughs> thing. Yeah. It's not your ship. I mean, they're wearing metal. All I have to do is electrocute them. Yeah, fair. Yeah, yeah. 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 Like tin foil. No, uh oh, not again. It's on us! Oh, it's above us! Oh, it's above us, it's among us. It's above us, it's among us. Oh. Among us. This would be, this would be either torpedoes or ink cannon. Oh, we tried torpedoes here and it didn't work. I remember this. Okay, so this was a torpedo. Yeah, we tried, we tried torpedoes here. Either well, kind of never so they already I think this should have been the one for the torpedo. Oh, we have the either cannon charge up this time. Yeah. Uh, so I think we already used it though, so I don't think we can use it again. Maneuvers? I don't think we have. We didn't use the either cannon. We haven't used the cannon yet. Yeah. The last time we used the cannon, we used the cannon. We used the cannon. We used the cannon. We used the cannon. The dark monument suddenly falls behind before rocketing past the bow. Nearly colliding with the legendary ship. The pilot has the following options. Heavy artillery. Evasive maneuvers. You have 30 seconds to choose. Evasive we only have maneuvers. those two. Evasive maneuvers. Evasive maneuvers. Yeah, evasive maneuvers. Evasive. Evasive. Evasive maneuvers. Evasive. 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 Yep, evade. I imagine they're going to repeat what we did to them. Well, I'm actually going to have my hands out properly to prepare for my... Yeah. 
potential falling off the ship from the shaking. Something. <laughs> nice loud keyboard. Yes, yes. Are we gonna be doing smack, 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 smack. I don't smack. hear much you conversation against the choice. Therefore, Even. I will skip oh, and oh, ask someone now. Let's see. Oh, we, we chose oh, evasive maneuvers. Right, yeah. let someone ask, let him ask someone. Let Sheen make Get a choice. Yes. Yeah, Sheen, we chose evasive maneuvers. Yeah, no, 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 let Sheen choose. Let Sheen let choose. Let choose someone. That's yeah, alright. Kirby. That's alright, Kirby. Evasive maneuvers, you say, is that right? Yes, oh, because okay. heavy artilleries are from the side, and then she says, like, from the side, <laughs> here. in front of us. Our, and our only option in front is of top. evasive maneuvers. I'm ready to fall off the ship again. The pilot. Prepares to use evasive maneuvers, but before she can act, the dark oh, monument fires twin missiles. So that means the ether cannon would be right here or something. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> we haven't used the ether cannon yet, and yet the other we just we used it earlier. I, I did not I hear was it. the one who selected it. Oh. Oh crap! Incoming. Oh, hold on. Missiles. Oh, oh, that's gonna hurt. What a glorious animation that was. Okay, at least yeah. that wasn't on the edge of the ship that rest. time. Now we know. Now now we know. That would have been a glorious one. Yeah. 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 ship yeah. takes heavy damage. My shiny splat. My friends, this way to the center. You mean the one that's been blown out? <laughs> yes. Are, are any of us part of the group hug? Where'd he go? Alright, that's, so. that's three times we failed so. at something. Quick, quick, get the board. Yeah. Somebody get the bucket. The soy you <laughs> long <laughs> live the king. Heavy artillery is definitely employed. In order to off oh, hey, heavy artillery. Oh, boy. Hey, hey boy. Heavy heavy artillery. Artillery. Time time The dark artillery. monument banks up close, <laughs> starboard side. The pilot only has one option left to choose from. Heavy artillery. Heavy artillery. Yes. Does anyone <clears throat> disagree? No. Nope. No. I do not. Give them everything they've got. No, Let's do the artillery. Heavy. No. All right. Fine. Em Emerald gets to artillery. Wait. This is our last best option. Can we? Can we throw? Can we throw the L man at the dark monument? No. 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 One person At cannot take time, an army on alone. If your avatar possesses projectiles, please load it and get ready to fire. Hell yeah. The pilot chooses uh, heavy artillery. I don't even have a gun. <laughs> the dark I, monument uh, opens fire. <laughs> bang, bang, bang. Oh, bang. We're going to have to use with red heavy artillery cannons. I mean, cannon. it's I'm using less than attack. What if I hand the ammunition? <laughs> This, that, this is the best thing I've got. Robotic, you're my ammunition. Oh, I am the ammunition. Okay. It takes heavy damage. Well, yes, is this working? <clears throat> oh. Is this working? Right. There we go. Oh, oh. Alright, did that work? Are you just well, a gun? Red ether so proved yes. useful this time and not dangerous. <laughs> I think we got him, Chief. We're out of actions. Why bring the heavy artillery when I can be the heavy artillery? Damn it. <laughs> That's scary. <laughs> <laughs> Flying is scary. Skin ether memento shield. Uh oh. Here we go. Uh -oh. <laughs> Wait. Uh oh. We did was fly into it. Um, uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, oh crap. Shit. All right. Oh, 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 Skin ether memento shield quickly. Shield up. <laughs> Everyone! <laughs> we may have to cramp in here a little. Hey, the dark the monument suddenly appears and surrounds the legendary ship. 
Soon, an enormous ether cannon emerges from below the dark ship's deck. Blocked on all sides, the pilot is, the pilot is unsure what to do. Travelers, you have two minutes to answer the open question. Anything is valid. What will the pilot do? It is an open question. What am I going to think of using the ether cannon? Listen to the rat! Use the movie. Have we tried to use the gem before? Yeah. What can we do with the ether that we What is your question, Diamond? Do the travelers have in their possession the yellow ether crystal still? It is in the rendezvous. The answer uh, technically is yes. <gasps> Wait, Wait yes. can we pull it for here? Oh. Okay. Wait, is my, the someone go to transport here? Okay. Okay. White ether, okay. My suggestion White ether selected. I'm gonna try and pull it in if I can. We use the, well, we use the ether, ether amplifier. Right? And call uh, upon the mother and to get man. the yellow ether crystal, but I can't. I don't have yellow oh, ether in my selection. Oh, wait, it's my best bet right now. We could. We could. Yeah, we could yeah I can absorb ether and use crystal. I can provide a quick to fight off assist. the to fight off the dark. I'm not sure. I can barely sense the ether. We got this. We got this. So it's yeah, that makes sense. One minute remaining. Wait, can we? 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 The mother's one? mech just go in and kick ass. Or we could just ram yeah, the ship to the to the dark one. Nope. We tried that. We tried that last Ramming time. didn't work. And you see these yeah. mechs here. Yeah. They Wait, did. Wait, what if we gave the ether crystal that we have to the pilot so that she can uh, charge up the ether amplifier a bit faster? Um, no, 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 it's in the rendezvous. So, so, the ether crystal can be installed into the legendary ship at a time. Oh. Dang it. Ah, so, so we've already so we cannot use the yellow crystal What's our, here. Are we able to use the ether amplifier at all? Nope. Should we just no, we've already... Should we we should actually sure like charge the ether from, from those crystals you have. It is charged. Uh, That's all I can tell you. Can we use it? It Travis. is charged? It's okay. It's charged. Well, well, we can maybe we can use the ether amplifier. Really yes. uh, All right. Maybe we can use the ether amplifier. Ether amplifier and amplifier. Thirty seconds. Call the mother. 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 We we charge we charge up the mother's mech. I say ram the mother's it. Mech we should ram the ship. Yeah, we tried that. We should, we should all focus our energy on the mother's mech. We should all not be strong enough yes. to deal with the mech. Yes, but we can deal with the other mechs around us. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, that giant cannon will be dead either way. Yeah, the giant cannon will be dead either way. Yeah, the giant cannon will be dead either way. Ram the ship! Shouldn't we, we, uh, ram the ship was a train we've already tried. Yeah, the ram the ship will work, they tried it. Ramming has been previously shown to be ineffective. We failed to ram the ship. We failed to ram the ship. But is it? No. Five, four, three, two, what emotion is orange? What emotion is orange? One. I don't know. My friends, your attention, please. Time has expired. Sumoko. Sumoka. Apologies if I am mispronouncing your name. What will the pilot do? Fire the ether amplifier. Oh. Keep that shield up, man. Let's call on the mother's amplifier. Uh, give her either the ether amplifier if you can. I'm sorry. Fire please repeat that answer. What? Uh, can no. we uh, call up the magenta neck and the mother? They have, they yeah, know. they've been charging their own ether amplifier, haven't they? <laughs> I see. Oh, yeah. Oh boy. Might get another bad, bad ending. Just a moment. Brace yourselves. I mean, that's I'm not a bad plot. But so we don't know what's going on. For improv right now. Oh, okay. Yep. <laughs> shuffle no, shuffle no, shuffle no, shuffle no. Bye. Okay. <laughs> the pilot. Oh, My I mean, friend. for all we know, nothing happens. The pilot turns on her communications. 
and searches for a magenta mech description that you all have given her. She finds it, and she tries to connect. She sends a broadcast through, asking for help. She sees a signal that it has connected, but there's no response. Her sensors pick up oh, that the magenta no. mech is unable to respond as it is engaged in heavy battle, outnumbered. Well, we tried. Oh, we tried. Another oh. bad ending. Can we try another thing? Yep. Uh, All right, people are going to gather inside yeah, and just dive into the momento cloud. shield and the thing died. And then we all going to have the dog. Hide from the, the, the black. Yep, now we do. The pilot to help the magenta mech or whatever. And if we, no, we don't have the torpedoes or something. Not like this. This can't be the end. I know I won't remember all of you, but travelers, remember my words from this uh -oh. passing. Don't lose hope. I hope I'll see you again. Bye. Don't lose hope. Don't, Don't lose hope. hope. That's it. Hope, hope, hope. Orange emotion. Mm. Ether. Hope. Orange. It's oh, no. Ether cannon. We charge the ah, oh, my red cage. Yeah. purple ether. Bad We got much closer, yeah. But I'm giving you as much as I can. Oh, well. We're dead. Wait, why are you here talking about that? I think I may give you too much of it. My friends. The legendary ship burned from the inside out, spirals oh out of God. the sky towards the earth in flames. Please, this way to the broken save point. Drats! Oh, we tried. <laughs> we did try. Oh, well. Like, hold me. Hope. It was don't always going hope. to be like this. So, don't lose hope, right? So, probably the... Uh... <laughs> this... Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, oh dear. The bad ending. Yep. We, we oh, really jonesed it up this time. Yet again. We always jones it up. Oh, wow. I'm going to hop on this ship I can't. So much I could. Dead oh, Bucky. Yeah. But I can't. <sighs> Not even everything on fire is invisible. The sky burns Definitely hope is the over a dead this. ship, a false yes, legend. The magenta mech lies defeated, with the sobbing daughter inside, clinging to her mother. The gray soldiers pull her off the woman's lifeless body as they surround the machine. She cries for Mama, for anyone to hear her. And someone does. Sophia, you live a life of false causality, a prisoner of fiction that was never meant to be. Foolish you are to waste your power here. Dream not for what is unwritten, but instead for what was erased. Allow me to rid you of the corrupt false gods that observe us. Wait, what? The gray soldiers drop dead, releasing the girl. <laughs> The daughter falls unconscious as black crystal forms around her, cracking as it grows to encase her. Dream for me, Sophia. Dream of a dark place out of their sight. A place that begins the end. Relinquish your power unto me. Oh, Oh, okay. Does it break your heart when I kill your characters? Do you feel sure they will be alive when you return? Wee.
Hey, it looks like hell down there. Uh oh. Down there. Where do we go? Wait. Yeah, it is hell. Does it scare you when I speak through your guides? Does it unsettle you that they obey I I and I say can... my oh. lines? This is not looking good. Oh jeez, that was close. Good thing we stopped. Does it scare you oh, when I s- Do you grow uncertain of where I am speaking from? Surely you feel safe from me behind your avatars and headsets. Surely... A demon in a story can't hurt you. Okay, this is getting way too personal. I fold. <laughs> Into hell we go. <laughs> I've been I here before. It's not as exciting as one might. You friend. just talked about my physical body, and I don't feel <laughs> I comfortable. I know. What I'm <laughs> I know. Go on, guys. Lots of nice people. Tra Travelers. Travelers. <laughs> Travelers. Listen carefully. This. This is wrong. <laughs> this place. We are not supposed to be here. <clears throat> Something isn't right. Travelers. Everyone. Run. I'm not sure. Okay. Oh, I see it. 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 Oh, I Go to electric boogaloo. Yet again. Go to electric boogaloo. We'll get the good ending right before. Let's see if we figure out what does what. And when to do it. Oh. 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 If we die in real life, does that mean we die in the game? At least we made it closer. Yes. I mean, technically, yeah. Because you won't be here to play the game. Is that the hell? My friend. Sounds a negative counter to their own. Looks like a hangman. My friend. One last time. I beg. Your observance. Welcome to the end of everything. Welcome to the bad ending of the pilot. Again. Again. My friends, this is the end of the tour. I hope you have enjoyed it. I'll take a rest for just a moment. And then I'll have a few announcements. Please come back in a few moments. The floor Please is yours. Run, how deep are we? Run, how deep are we? Mm, moment, just sit. All right, so. Oh, oh that's what's up. Demon King, kind of looking like Doom Boss. I'm gonna go join Tix now. I'm gonna screw yeah, this up in the future. I'm gonna screw this up in the future. I'm gonna cut out. I blame you. Okay. Good night. Always in. I just want to have fun with you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna head out. I'll see you later. Okay, this is not my fault. No, it's your fault. One more thing. I got it. My friends. Perhaps. Or something. We are VR travelers. We do this for free. We do this for fun. We do this for you. We do ask one thing in return before you go. We ask that you join our Discord community and post your photos or your comments from today's tour there. There you can discuss the alternate endings to our tours, the secrets of our headquarters, the rendezvous, and the other mysteries. The Discord ID is my status in VR chat. 
Finally, friends, if you really enjoy the work our team puts into this and you want to help us write more stories, please support us on Patreon. Our tours are free, and always will be free, but our Patreon is only $3 per month, and joining grants you access to play the NPCs in our tours, as well as lots of other stuff. That's all, friends. I hope that you had fun. The end. Thank you. Yay! 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 I'm unsure of that. Sure. I certainly am. Don't the one be with doing this stupid well, no, tower no, defense no, again. Who did you say who was the other one? I was going to do the tower defense. He's trying to do the tower defense. I didn't realize he was going to do the tower defense.